I am your vibe, one of Jamaica's premier radio disc jock, a man who wears many hats, artist, producer extraordinaire. His parents named him Michael Brissett, but we know him as ZJ Liquid, Mobius Sun, H2O, Zip Jack Liquid, a bag of stuff. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right, sir? Yeah, but good, you know. Give thanks for there, you know what I mean? Give thanks. One the greatest right. thing that we're there, and thanks for reaching out. A simple one, three, man. Yeah, man, I appreciate it. Simple maths, man. Teach them! Always make sure the message I reach them! So far, the liquid. Yeah. So all is well. Yeah, man. Mm. Most things. Most things. Talk to us, though. Early life. Place of birth. Place of birth, you know what I mean? Montego Bay, St. James. Yeah? Connell Regional Hospital. No, not Connell Regional Hospital. To be honest, we born at 71. Lot 71 Rosemount. So, one birth? Yeah, my mother tell me that story, you know? <laughs> I born up at my uncle's house. Oh, that okay. was like the top house. Okay, you know? The yard was like two, two lots. Oh, okay, family okay. controller mm -hmm. run from one road to the next road, so like to the next avenue. Mm -hmm. You know, so my mother tell me some my born in my uncle's house. And then, you know, like one or one when we reached two, my mother and my father, you know, they been married before them have me. My father was an accountant. Yeah. You know what I mean? You know, my mother, she do hair, hair dressing and dress making and, you know, she had that type of person. Mm. You know? So, as some things start, then they married. You know, them get a house, one of them ski house, but it was in the, con in the rural part of mm. Amobia, same way, St. James, a place called Rampton, Rampton. Mafuta. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man, I can't remember, man, as a youth. I want to make a member. So them say I have elephant brain. Yeah? Yeah, but I can't remember. You know, I just remember my, my journey. Mm. Yeah, so, you know, that's how, you know, my father work and do him thing. He get a, get one of them ski mouse there. And I saw the life start. So the life start. Yeah. I did have, have a sister who was older than me, like two years. Yeah, that, I asked yeah man, I have, have two siblings. I have two siblings. I have a yeah. sister older than me and I have a sister younger than me. Oh, so yeah, I go one. Yeah, I had a go one. My sister them complained, so my mother spoiled me. Yeah. me had a boy, yeah. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> but okay. you know the thing, they never spoiled me. Yeah, I spoiled. love them same way, man. My sister them, same. trust me. Love yeah. Them. Bo uh, both siblings are still around? Yeah, man, still around, but not in Jamaica. It's a blessing that same way, man. Yeah, man, them, them, you know, talk to them used to the same way. Mommy, Mother's Day. Mommy and daddy still about? Mommy still about, daddy not here. The old man Chadan? Yeah, my old man Chadan, you know? My sympathies, brother. Yeah, man. Michael Mickey Brissett. Michael you don't know me, I'm the junior. Yeah. You might see Oh, cool, yeah. cool so man. Cool, cool. I'm not going to make you know, say, you don't know me. Yes. I'm the same yeah, way. Yeah, I'm the same way. Yeah, man, definitely. My father, mm. I love him. Cause, yeah. You know, he was around all the time. He was around. You know, my band time. come see him and him there around all the time. You know, none of the things I want me to adapt now as a man. I'm a father, I'm a sit with them, I'm just know, say, yo, my father never deal with this, so, you know. So, I saw me I deal with it, I see my daddy deal with it. Makes sense. Yeah, definitely, you know. Schooling, though, where did they attend? Schooling. I uh, started out infant school in Montego Bay, then. Yeah, bless up. <laughs> bless up, bro. Started out infant school in Montego Bay, you know. Mm. And then, uh, Move on to Colonel Day Avenue Primary. Car yeah, Colonel Day. Yeah, mm. Colonel Day Avenue Primary. Uh, graduated from Colonel Day at fifth grade. Yeah. Uh, first try at the common Come entrance. On entrance. One go. Yeah, one go. <laughs> and uh, from Colonel Day Avenue to Cornwall College. Yeah. Yeah. So my, you know, me do Cornwall College. Uh, did an engineering course. In, you know, did an engineering course of physics, technical drawing. Welding, ele electronics, agri science, bio, English maths. Well done. Everything balanced liquid, man. Uh, I, have, I, have, I have seven subjects. Yeah. <laughs> uh, get the second highest mark in a Cornwall County in a technical drawing. Nice, man. Yeah. You never did a farm fool when I got to school, brother. No, I never did a farm fool. I <laughs> love school, definitely. Love school. Yeah, the whole vibes are school. I love it. You know, I just pick up my whole music vibes from. I just some, you know, my friends, them, and them, when I meet at school, I branch out after school so till it turn into a way of life. Yes. You know? So the music started, or your 
pursuit of the music started from you were in school? From we were in school, from little. You know, normally my, my, my mother and my father, whenever they send me out, anyway, I, I see a sound string up. A problem, you know, I will spend an hour there, if y'all come look for me, it was just a habit of mine. I have to see the sound string up, I have to wait till it start play. You know, I was just so intrigued and so interesting to the point where, you know, I used to get all ready and take out the speaker them and get plyboard or Little box drinks box. back and make me back and you know I can, I yeah I can remember <laughs> one of the greatest joy to me was when my father gave me a walkman for my Christmas and then you know from this up the music when me started listening was like his music and my father was like a music lover okay but like a Sunday was theme vibes like every week him try to get a new cassette and you know back in the day when I get the cassette them every song right out with the name Panic, panic, yeah, panic so as you go along and I listen as a youth, if you don't know, you, you, you look panic, yeah, and you learn, yeah, from back in the day. But you know, every song play out. So my father used to have different vibes, like Tom Lins, and him have him Barrington Leave, him Dennis Brown, you know, him have him Grace Trillers, them have him something. Them. Cause you know music, on a Sunday when I listen to music, I vibes. Him start right. with him Christian, then him go in and Tom Lins, him Eptones them, and then him go in and some D Brown, and... I understand Barrington Levy and them things there, and then, you know, in the latter part of the afternoon, you know, say, I'm going to play some uh, 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 like a various mix, I want to go on. Yes. So the song them were hot at that time, you know, yeah, because yeah, you know, say, me I want something that I love to <laughs> at the end of the day. Yeah. You know, so I can remember vividly even my Sundays with my father. Start out where you wake up, you can't eat breakfast unless you drink the aloe vera. Aloe vera, and you have you used, used to squeeze the original orange juice out of the squeezer, and we used to crack the egg and only the egg white. And you know, him say, Yo, that used to that to make your, 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 your clean out, clean the out system. your system, and you understand. And so that was Finny and him thing. I have to drink it with him, not breakfast before that. And you understand, yeah. after that, I would have to push out and get him Sunday cleaner. Yeah. Every Sunday. Routinely. Yeah, every day. My father was a paper man. As he had known the paper, as he done read it, he man it down to me. And you know, those that are some of the things. Too. Yeah, so means that you always exposed to what's going on, even just by the newspaper. And I love listening to the radio. That it was important, man. Yeah, you understand? Yeah, man. And we used to watch the football international go right down to the Sunday matinee till when at dinner time man. you don't know you do your chores, because up on a Sunday, I don't got I don't go ahead and talk. With my dear my grandmother, and at the time, at one point, I don't know, my, my father did, you know, break up with my mother. Oh, okay. So I end up have this, go with my father, where, you know, my stepmother. Mm. At one point, I just have to go live with my father directly and live with my father and my stepmother because when I when my pass come an entrance, you know, it was easier for me to we go to school from, from where Danny. my father was at the time. You know what I mean? So I live near in the town and I saw me end up in a mobile you now, mm. in the city now. Princess Street, Queen Street, Princess Street, St. James Street, at the town that you go down this uh, parade, Sam Shark Square. We walk them road, I used to walk go to school. I never used to have a tech taxi. I used to walk go to school. You know what I mean? Right up to high school. I could walk go to school. You know, you know them days uh, as a school youth. To a mobile thing run and taxi thing, cause we not mobile never do, where we live we not do bus. Mm, a, a taxi. As a school out here, a taxi man I say, yo, one school as a loan you might take up. So sometimes you're there up on the road in the early morning <laughs> as a youth. You, you, you left out early and, and still late. end up. If you don't want late, you have to decide to say, I'm to it to them, I'll just go and walk. Till on the way, you may get a, a taxi may come full up, turn back around and say, come youth. You know, you have to eat at the mega sit out. Sit out! You know, we ever get to sit out. We never get a window yet. Or. Yeah, you can't tell. You know what I mean? Yeah, man, we, we, we grew up, but we don't complain. Yeah. Yeah, I reach a school. From reach a school, everything all right. Yeah, I reach a school, for, everything all right. For me, school was like the happiest place every day. One of. Yes. You know what I Because, you know, we click. You know, me, 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 me. Me, the high school, not the era when Game Boy bus and Super Mario and. You understand me, David? So you don't know. They yeah, call it baseball, lot of them thing that was one of the trend and you know the thing go. I care how much you know your khaki. After school, out of your John Sport leather bag, cause you know that time there was the was the was leather bag them at beating them. I can't tell you, yeah, me love, tell them I love school cause it was the vibes. Mm. Every trend me into it as a youth and we are vibe with it. You don't know you take out your peak whether you're Yankee or tar. 
Whether you can buy it or your people them send in, send it in, the people them come in at some time and bring in two at. Yeah, I can remember you, I get a, get a Atlanta A's at you know. mm. Green, yellow, you know, bro. <laughs> With the studs them from the A, you know, like a diamond, you know. Cornwall College, nine grade, you know. Peak around the place, you know. <laughs> if after school you can't take out your peak, and go so, and walk across Mount Alverna with the girl them there, clean, you're not, you're not good. You're not good. <laughs> Yo, take out my peak, bro. And go so. Ready, and we say, ah, school done. Every man has a step. We just feel something, go so. At first, me I wear my peak, you know. <laughs> a man just take it and gone, because you know them days, yeah, man, I take it at, man. Man, I take it at head and gone, man. Yeah, man, you know what I mean? Mobile was just a vibe still. Enough things going on Mobile, you know what I mean? Enough yeah, things going on Mobile. Enough yeah, things still going on Mobile, right? Yeah, I remember the second week in, a, second week in a high school, Conway College. I get robbed. Shoes, everything. <laughs> Car. We are playing school, ball after school. Because you know, we reach a carnival now and every man wants to show them ball skills. Because deep up. Naturally, naturally. You don't know how you want to make the class side. Mm. So you know the thing, every man get active, neat. You don't know them say PE and require by your jersey, them man. Shank yard and socks. So you know, say a man will have two left foot out, well clean. Because <laughs> requirements to get your jersey yeah, and your thing. Yeah, you see me? Cardinal. Yeah, so remember the first, the second week, man. I have P the day there and I say, yo, we're going to play ball after school. Cause regular thing. We love to play ball after school. Cause if we try to get taxi in the early, they don't carry away. They don't carry the big people. Them. So we just use it, you, yeah, br- br- use the time the same way. Our brace and play some ball. Like sometimes we just left from the far field where we play and just walk. Because we used to live up now. Would. See me yeah? Go- yeah, man. Golf now, would, man. When it just start. Oh, okay, okay. Enough walking and thing, man. Care what up on head, man. I'll tell them about that. Because I got through it as a youth. Enough people know because they must still liquid and feel so it was nice. Yeah. You know what I mean? But, but it's nice because on a, on a rough time I could do it. It's just better right. men to have do it. My father did one. Mm. Yeah, better men. So, so, so like there was some struggles in that too? Not really struggles, you know. I said struggles. Because Looking back on how, how my parents did think, I don't see it as a struggle. Mm-hmm. They just said, want better men. Because as I said, my father did buy a house first for my mother. And right. When we break up, he never take that. He leave me and my sister with my mother okay. and go do him own a thing. And then he link up with my stepmother now. I love her because she's like a mother to me the same way. You understand? They don't know the thing, enough things she teach me as a youth. And I'm bad to say about them. Them journey there. What are them journey they build me? I mean, I experience enough things, yes. you know what I mean, which is knowledge mm. at the same time. So, you don't know, the journey was this. I'm going now, I'm seeing now would as a cap, now was as a capture land at the time. Free land, everybody said over there was a nice place, because it have the view where you can see the airport and oh, oh, that side of now would was if you go down flanker, mm. up on the you know, the hillside. So, in here's the land over there and them got him get piece of the land. And I said, boy, we know them all survey it in a future <laughs> and thing. You know, I saw the place run. You don't know a different place than town, if you understand them thing. Yeah. So it go. So we are, it go around them, them cut road and them thing. So we know it a survey, but water and over the line over there. Father get peace and nice peace, can a lot and him say, yeah, I'm going to go and build a house car. Next house. Cause at the time we live where we live in in Mobile, Princess Street. That was a tenement yard. Yeah. That, oh. that was like four hours, about, about 15 different families, enough youth. That is a total different story again. That's how I, feel, that's how I learned how to live around enough people. Mm. I know how to get along. Because them times they did nice. You understand? <laughs> you man, I laugh. Yo, B, I can't tell them. That's what I tell them. I do everything. Yeah. I slide, wheel, gig. You know, I remember back in the day when Coca Cola did have a, 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 a gig thing. Different color. I mean, you see, I walk the dog, everything as a youth, me crazy with it, competition. <laughs> man, I laugh. Yeah, man. Yo, yo, man. Eh? Yo, yo. Yo, yeah, yo, yo. yo. yo but right. me do gig too, yeah, gig. Me do yeah, the gig, man. yeah, me do gig too. Where we cut out and. Yeah, man. Card and. Yeah. You do everything well. Right? Yeah, as a youth, because I'm telling you, I grew up in a tournament yard with enough other picnic. So it was like a gang away at our age, where we come from school, we touch the road. 
I go through the life there in them times the way. My, my family no come from work, you know, my father account and my stepmother at work. So they might come in like five, me come from school like three. We used to watch all cartoons through my friend them window the whole away. Because one yard that, you know what I mean? The yard the only yard that open on the TV. I you know? watch with Thunder Cats and you understand? Bad yeah, you understand me? I deal with Star Wars and the thing them. Yeah well. So as a little youth, the whole group thing there at all times was, you know, me, you know learn how to share and we go a bird bush and whatever we catch. And that with us Roast sure and, and the whole with us, you know what I mean? Take peace and, you know. Unity. Yeah, man. Mm. So we, while at Cornwall now, you were starting to, to delve in the music, even though you grew up around the music. Yeah, while at Cornwall now, I started love the music. So now my father buy me the workman and I move on from that. But there and now, would. music come from my grandmother, my grandmother yard. Yeah. I always go up on weekend. See, my two uncle them are Rasta. So them into music. When I'm uncle, my bubble. Him in and out of the country. Because he doesn't know he migrate. Mm. But him there in New York, he come three months, spent three months in Jamaica, the next three months. So always, the other uncle him there now. So him, as I tell you, we have two lot. My uncle controlled a lot with FEMO. So he did have a friend named Father White. Bless him soul, RIP. Father White was a man now who made cassette for people. So he's a man who has enough record. He buy everything. Back in the day, wow. people, yeah, you go to the record shop. And you had, you had a cassette with your list and then make your cassette and you get a special cassette oh, okay. So it's yeah. a man who used to make cassette with like foreign and the, the Yankee them and the European them and love dance all and reggae. So he did have all type of music, all type of Rasta music, all type of band, he have the no thing them. So as a youth we go a Rose Mount, on the weekend I'm a grandmother. First place I'm going to go up a father white cup, so the music there. Right? <laughs> so whenever I make cassette, the music say, yo Bruce it. Turn over the, the, the record for me or pass that. But some used to learn how to lift up Nigel from him mm. because I want turn table. But in, when I make a, say I make a, a Bujo CD, see? A Bujo cassette. Yes, right. If you put on a Bujo album and it play and write where it play where it part where, where the space go, you know, you pause it for a three seconds, let it go. So on the cassette you don't really have no space. You know what I mean? So some me used to do them little thing there. I'm say, yo, whatever. So the album we done, him say, yo, pause it and turn it and make it go and catch from the top. So me just learn, so I saw me learn how to lift up me and learn how to, and so me start get curious about it. So when me go back over my father, you know, me start look at whole turntable come on. So me get a whole turntable from out of change and set it up and have it a work and find one whole arm, so me a man sell me, get speaker and make me one little speaker box and buy me pies of tweet and put the condenser upon it. So I start buying my one one record them now with my lunch money. So I come out, if I buy all two records, I'm, I'm happy. I play them, lift them up over and over, I'm happy with it. So now there was a thing named Virus. Where I read him, they must put it on one album. A and B, mm -hmm. all of the songs them. So I say, yo, I start buying Virus because I buy Virus, I get more songs. Get more songs. Right, so I start buying the Virus. With the, yeah, with the at rhythm them. So I used to listen to Donovan Dakers. And listen to the chart, them JBC, them used to lift on the radio as a youth and listen. So everything I me hear and like, I save my lunch money. Yeah, on a Friday, a Friday new music come my record shop, I go buy. When I can't buy, I used to just stand up at a record shop and listen to everything them play till I'm ready for go home. I take a I take a taxi and go on now. Yeah? Yeah. And that that, that was that was one of my fun time. All on a Friday when I mean, that was one of my fun time. I'll a Friday, I mean, I say, Friday was new music day. I used to just stand up at the record shop and hear every car people. You sound them, everybody come by a record. So the record man used to do, yo, I like that. So you, you, you start getting to hear what at because what at start playing more. I hit people are select more. If you never did go in nothing on them days, you know, you know, because when you go in a record shop, your record pile up, so you know, not nah, selling. You, know. you know? So I saw me get interested in the music and then. I go to school, my, 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 school, my school friend, Pero, he did love music like me, and, but he was more advanced. And people they be doing one of them tour bus company then in a Mobi. Uh, so he used to live in a man, Mango Walk, which was one of the, the high end. Like, Mango Walk was like a Jack Seal and okay, yeah, so, community. Right, so I used to go home with him, because where he lived was nearer to Norwood. So I used to go home, a female, play music. And then go to my yard. Then we meet Jason now. Then we meet Jason. 
Jason Russell. Jason Russell, Pier One. Mm. Right, see him father them one, Pier One at the time. So him started going to Carnival, we become friends. So we used to follow Jason, because Jason said him have a set, a Pier One now, a full sound with turntable and through them around a the club now, him have the 12-inch and the new music, then the disco and the hip-hop now. Remember, we don't know hip-hop like that. Yes. But so me, go, so me, so, so me, that's how me, me I get exposed to them genre they know. When me start here on the radio and I say, yo, them wanna have them music here too. So Jason, we used to, we used to, after, after school, we used to go peer one, go hang out now and go play. Not, not really play, just chill out. Now Jason's sister used to do a modeling thing. She named Peter Game. I have a bigger up because Peter Game first, but me touch the, the turntable yeah. like that. She used to do a modeling thing every Wednesday. So, the girls then used to rehearse on Tuesday. It was four of us. Me, Virginia Perro, seen. My other Virginia Funky, him dead. <laughs> yeah. R.I.P. Funky. R.I.P. Funky. Jason. And, you know, other you would see me around the click. So, Jason had this sound. We decided to say, yo. In excess, and all well, we start go school now. So, every man start is that we, like we automatically farm into a role. Every man start taking a role. Funky was an electronics, you oh, damn. crazy about that, like camera system. Mm. And so, you know, him had the man who has string up and a deal with speaker, him wants to string up the sound, man. you know, him had that type of man. Him no one really want to play that, him want though. So, Funky and Jason was really that, them deal with the sound. So, but Jason really owned the sound kind right, father. Right. So, when Peter gave the rehearsal now. Pero was the main selector at the time. He was the main DJ. Right. And me just a follow up and I learn. So me was him youth. She always want disco. Because you know a fashion show. Right. And we get that vibe there. Eh? Man, they must say, yo, me don't play no disco, you know. Then time the time MC and my them are thing, you know. Man, I said, dog, you know, no, I'm up on some funky thing, you know. Because <laughs> I don't know, you know, them time yeah. they said the disco thing was a free funky, thing. Yes. With the big pants, man. Hey. So them time it was like black box and strike it up. I got the power. You know, them, them things that used to run the place, them tap disco there. So no man now want to play the modeling song. So I suck. I, that's how me get a chance on the turntable. <laughs> everybody want to play when I dance all and hip hop. Right. That time Perro want to play, because you know, Perro was the man at, at the time. Big up Perro, you know what I mean? Nothing teach me, I'm better than that. So me use the time when them no want to play disco. I say, yo, me play. So, I'm going to start playing, strike it up, and the thing, and, you know? So, them start keeping me around, because them say, yo, Lip don't have a problem with, with playing those music. It's okay. And I say, yeah, man, I'm my little thing that. So, me start concentrate on the little 12-inch them and the hip-hop music, them now. But at the end of the day, me fall in that thing where I go and learn how and me sort out the music and sort out the rhythm. Because back in the day, you know, a record box here travel. Right. You sort out the record and put the rhythm together and how you play. And, mm. When you play, you put back your album them in the right case. Cause when you juggle, you take out the album and you look at the wrong album because you're juggling mad. You know what I mean? Enough thing, everything about them days, you know. I want to tell you, if you remember, you put all the record and can't find it, you know, trouble, you know. You put all the record and you check it in the eagle, I'll bend up our wall. Yo, nothing on play clear, kill your set. Yeah. Enough little thing. So, I so saw start grow and get my little play them. You know, so till me start go up here when the man them dead. I say, yo, I want more space and I want to learn that thing. Yeah. So I start going up here when I'm my daddy and going to the music room. Because she me I play the disco for Peter again. You know. She's all right with me. So mm. sometimes she walk me the music room. I say, yo, I want to get familiar with the disco. Them, when I play for the fashion show, teach them. And I saw I start get my little space and start fool around on the turntable. Because then the pair of them did have it locked. I have an ex youth where I learned a lot from them youth that was like so futuristic. The way I used to think and, and work, I know a youth named Jeremy. Yeah, Jeremy. man. Yeah, Jeremy. He named, used to call him DJ Jeremy. Now we talk about scratch up record in the mouth. Mm. You know what I mean? You know, one of the great ones like that was, was DJ Wayne. Master Wayne. Master Wayne. You don't know him as that. But when I grew up, and I learned me and, me and Jason them now, I start building a little son. It was Wayne Morris. Wayne Morris. Can use him real name. Oh. Older than me, but he was the man. He was the DJ we met and said, yeah. 
scratch mix hip hop. So, so, so we and was from Moby as well. Exactly. Don't tell you how we link. That's why the sound. That's why the sound I like. But it's a sound that me and him create together by by, by forwarding together as the first solo DJs. I tell you the story. Let's get to it. So we used to listen. <laughs> so Pier One was the biggest club. Yes. Everybody called Pier One. Meaning we said. Pier One was the biggest club, it was like the asylum. From you come at Kingston and you want to hear about club where you come asylum. from. Farin, whether you are uptown, whether you, whether you are tourists, Pier One. So you know Moby have that influx of tourists. So the hotels they make sure say, the place the party was Pier One on a Friday night. So you have that. So Pier One ran from all 10 o'clock and some people come eat dinner because it was a restaurant also. And then them stay for the disco. Right. We we'll start at 10. The disco now, Pier One never have a Pier 1 in excess sound didn't play for the disco because it was too small. Mm. Pieces, Pieces disco, which was like the renaissance of Moby, the uptown sound, so. the juggling sound, I play seven days a week. If you want to make money and ramp, party ramp, Pieces. book pieces, Lija, one Chinese brother. <laughs> so you know, say hustling, serious, yeah. no joke, no, no. Lija had enough to learn from him. So pieces used to play, pieces come string up now, so I start get exposed to the big sound thing and see how the big sound work. Because we leave school there, appear on the rest of Friday night, pieces are string up a big night. Going. Pieces always have the thing them are. One year one new dub, because them always a clash too. Okay. Always a clash with Black Cat, Gyro, them. Constant, so as I tell you, everything new them have. Plus, there were two owners, Lai Judge and the other owner, were, other owner, owner was Andrew. He worked at daytime. At the airport. Oh. So he's a man who fly out every week. I have that privilege to fly because I work at the airline. So Andrew was a DJ. So Andrew was responsible for the hip hop and the disco and anything what hit the charts. So we did expose to the fresh music and all genres from me. I learned. So it's not a zip thing where you see me come and play disco and hip hop. Long time. Yeah, me was a youth feet and mobile. Me and DJ Wayne. So that look at this cutting there from around Peter Gay start coming and you know, start brother. coming and because the pier one was a place so you have to play everything. Soul, old school, hip hop, dance hall, soca, reggae. You have to play a set of Bob Marley. The whole musical spectrum cover. Afi. Mr. Russell was the type of man who was at his, out at his gate. I from 10 to 4.30 where the club done. We used to get punished because I listen. And whichever genre we miss, miss out, the money shot. <laughs> and the motel Lija had said, Lija, them boy never play no Bob Marley tenor, tenor. We never hear no, never play no soul. Money shot. And the motel said, Mr. Russell said, never play no soul. So it was always instilled in with a change genre member to please everybody because Piran was an international club. Good training that brother man. We couldn't play Love Pun on the bad. We could have hardly play like Mumbai but we used to just have a sample it. We couldn't play nothing with, with bad word and anything there. Yeah, because Mr. Russell was on it. And that, yo, we learn of you see all the whole rock and roll I'm segment. For reader, you know, no, no, I'm preparing for the world because I took over Moby and all of that before me even got radio. Yeah. And my style me bring to radio. Yeah, my style our style change radio. Yeah. So, Which is true. So we start doing all of that. That was the routine. After play all the, the rock and roll, the rock, everything. So that was in, that, in our jogging. Sometimes we get crazy with it and mix in all the scam. Most of the place. They must say, yo, them youth are creative. And I'm tell you, at the time, one made that play a pair one. Who am I share the stage? Fraggy Rock. Fraggy Rock. Who is now Bada General. Bada General, fear bridge in the barrel, man. Alright. <laughs> oh. I don't know who's a Bada General in the selector to work. Bada General is Fraggy Rock from Pieces and Mad Squad. Okay. He's my Fraggy Rock. We live and we learn. <laughs> so you see, I'm glad I kind of get to tell the story and make people understand how all of this intertwines. Yes, man. And wait, so. Frag used to play the juggling because he had the main bad selector from pieces. You know, he used to clash with Panther, ask, any, ask any one of them yeah. about Fraggy Rock from pieces Fraggy and Strike and Quarry and Light Judge. See? Dog box, tall, deep, everything in it. And then we learn from the, the hardcore part there. Yeah. So during that time, Frag Rock used to leave school and me used to leave Cornwall. Because Frag used to go to Anchovy Eye and me used to go to Cornwall. Yeah, no. mm. and, you know? 
Frag used, Frag used to play all nuts and lie to you about him and bring him in. I said, hey, boy, I'm going to be able to say, hey, the boy, I can't mix him clean. <laughs> when I'm taking my sick, when I'm talking, I say, you're roaring with this. As a little youth in a khaki, so the whole of were like the same level because so we are strive. We listen to the stone of them and the thing them every day. And I say, yeah, warm to you. Yes, so we there are some little youth. Serious, there <laughs> are some little youth. Man, laugh. <laughs> you come like this, you eat pee off. Yeah, eat pee off with you, man. So, we play the pier one them and so so we start grow. So in excess start growing up because we start get popular and we start get better. So Jason started to take like the sweet 16 book in them and them party, the birthday party them. Car, you know, so Jason the uptown youth and mm. clean and the girl them love him. Say so, have the girl them. Not like my, G, my, my friend have the girl them. Yeah. No joke nothing I'm thing. You see me? <laughs> so we used to get the sweet 16 them and through the Ragua Carnival. Moby I was at all girls school. Mortal oh, Verna the neck. So we used to play like the Mortal Verna fear and the thing them. So whenever we mash up them fear there, you know, the girl would say, Yo, girl. they wanna play a birthday party. So the girl used to request me. So every week. You know out there. Yeah, we're out there. And then Pierre One used to do like catering on Saturdays for weddings and stuff. So they used to include we as a set as a package. Oh. And I saw me start learning how to play at weddings now. I learned the soul music and so you see, every day I'm in a different zone as a little youth. Cause we are try, you know, we love music so much. Sometimes we used to get like Mr. Russell private function in the house. And we used to bring theme record collection come and some learn like the old this the old the old seventies disco them and the soul them and you know the scatter lights and yeah. I saw me learn them, you see, they say, come boy, this is my rare and you used to come with theme collection. Sometimes I'll sing in it when I want and say, yo, you know, long more on the song. I say, we, we all teeth, we take it, put it in our box. Yeah. We just know, say, Jason, you're on the song. <laughs> Sorry, I just wanted to have it, but yeah. this, we need it. Because sometimes you have some of the sample them with the hip hop, with the old and new. And we used to do that a lot. In you know, the club, for just interchange and. Yeah, man, we know what it is. And I saw we grow and start playing the Sweet 16, them and. DJ Wayne now, named Wayne Morris, top DJ. We, DJ Wayne was a DJ like this from day one. He started playing from 10 o'clock till 7 o'clock in the morning. Non stop. Him alone. He man mix himself. Yeah, man, everything. Man mix, man. Disco, dance hall, everything, and him talk, everything. One go. Man, them party they used to record from cassette and run back the place. When I listen to them back, I say, yo. We are DJ when to play live, scratch, mix, everything. So you used to go out DJ when them house party, you know, house party used to run mobile, like the uptown segment of mobile used to keep mm. house party, but they still take on everybody car. Yes. A big thing. So when the man keep house party, DJ when I play. You know the name? Wayne Morris, that I name. Wayne, Wayne Morris. Morris. Music by Wayne Morris. Lord, <laughs> please, I got sick. I saw mute. We want to go because we want to hear him go play because we not left till daylight. So DJ, Wayne Morris. Yeah, Wayne Morris, him run them party there. So we used to go at Brandon Hill house party them and it was a thing. When it, if, if you have a Wayne Morris house party this weekend, don't keep nothing. Flop. I don't ask you, don't keep nothing. DJ Wayne, DJ Wayne alone used to run them party there. And we say, yo, the whole city I'm going to be there. When you look on the side of the road, them, at them place, they go straight down left. Left, right, here. And that I play till the light. Yeah. Everything you get, every genre, every segment. Upon right timing. Right timing. Yeah. <laughs> I remember when I empty out place. Yeah. So, I say, eh? So, I want to deal with it. So, I deal with it. I so, till we're dead. Start grow, bro. Start go up here on every day, all early, two, four hours before every man. So I play, so I play, so I play, practice, practice. Play all son, them left me yard, gone down, them grandmother said, Where you go? I said, Mom, go on a pier one. Buy me cassette them from Mr. Chin, me D90 them. And I used to make three cassettes or two cassettes every day. And go home and listen to them. So. And I say, Yo, the goal is no mistake. Because remember, we, them times where I used Nigel. And it's when time I get. I cast them to no 90 minutes, no nigga jump, no mistake, no joke mix. So we start keep it now. We say, yo, and this one, no mistake here in our thing. And I so I start grow myself, bro. I have some days I'm going and say, yo, I want to learn from scratch. I'll two, three weeks. Man, them ball up here one. Dog all the way around for a man in a pickle, pickle, pickle. <laughs> yo, when we done with some record, man, then scratch out, we have to buy back some new copy. 
I'm gonna learn, 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 I'm gonna learn. Learn, teach myself till we catch it. You see me? So till you I start go on now as a youth. And we have a clash with DJ when DJ and have a son named Pison. We end up a Pison. clash. <laughs> that is how we I rise up now. We know, till we end up a clash. And I said, DJ, Master Wayne. I said, listen, man, I can't sit in I'm going to clash with the man. <laughs> Free city. Yeah, was set up with someone and it was, a, it was by Dragon Gym. That was where them do boxing. Mm. That was the Mobile segment. Uh, where them have a, a boxing leg, you know? Like boxers and things. So that. They only say it was. Load up with someone and swing up and DJ when load up everything and we we'll get some dub and because we said different get some dub and be a thing loaded that you know them time they, them time they have to buy the record them with the sound boy this and sound boy that if you don't have dub because you know you're a little son <laughs> so you have hey, oh, cause them time they you have enough record where i say enough it, artifact them time they will yeah, this song still. yeah with enough sound song you know so i saw we load up and we get a, a one plate go down on the little dub plate still them time one name shy b west green catching all Advice of be a mobile artist, we say, I want to at least we are using a vice of them, be a combination. And we just make some song and believe in them, man. I remember the night, man, where I played place, Ram and Taguan, and round for round, and we had juggle so till. We just see one round. While we are playing DJ, we start string up four turntable. We are saying, them on a good four turntable. <laughs> Live remix in I Clash. With four turntable. But then time they will never play with dub them yet. Mm. So yeah, say, yeah, where am I going with four turntable? Yo, I clash this series. You know me as a youth as a talker, me they have a talk in them time they're sick. See so teach them. I want to man and jump me dub them and go and me a thing. And the man I say, yo, the youth yeah. <laughs> I, so, I, I clash me and DJ yeah. when clash and become friends. See? Mm. Me and start rolling. A DJ when father start some first, fame idea. Yeah? Yeah, Mickey Morris, if you ever hear the I name. I know the yeah. name, man. Yeah, great, man. Mr. Show you, DJ when father well musical and well instrumental and enough. At the history making thing in music. So he's a youth, a dead a long time, too. DJ when they have a son named Midas, and they have a studio. Same way, at the time where we are grew up mm. here, one. My father did have him, so he's well. He might have that well, part, yeah, string up music. sound and everything. He might have that. You know, when I just play records. Like for real, I tell you, we are, yeah. we are real sound people. We love every part of it. You know? The part that we you know, see, you know, we know them. We come mm -hmm. from the school. So. so the clash now with Starlink. Because I say, yo, Jano, you're not easy, you know, you. And mm -hmm. I say, yo, you're bad. Four turn <laughs> table, you're wicked, great, yeah. Great up on a different level now, but I don't know. I'm mean, Starlink and, you know, we start link up, we start coming up here one half on a Friday, come shell it to you. Because a man used to come with bass style, you know. When he comes to play up here one half, like one half an hour, own a mat and everything. Different niggle, them man they are screwing is a moment, you know. You got to say, the player now. Put the beer thing, you know? Yeah. I say, eh, everything good. In I lab, me there. In I lab. In I lab, I work. Because I tell you, in I lab. In I lab. Till me, I'm start link up and remember one night when father did one Great River was rafting. Yeah. So, one night, me, I'm link up and say, yo, Lippo. Father one great river and I link up. And we link up my animal and Jason and we go down the funky. And it was like a place with the tourists them. So you know the tourists them come, them have dinner. They watch some fire performance thing and do the rafting upon the river. And so we go down there and then they have a live band. Mm. So we go down there now and thing and that's when we go down with the DJ we and start playing the drum. <laughs> you know the band, you know? So I said, I can play a... sorry, you know, I said, blow wow. I said, blow wow G, you play a jump too. But him father did one studs band. Yeah. If you do the research, check out about studs, studs band. band. One of the baddest right. band them out of Mobile where you saw. They used to back Cabrian at the time. Oh, okay, cool. They used to back Cabrian at the time and him did sign with of the flex and them thing. Mm. They was the band for Cabra studs. So DJ when kinda of have the experience there. And I said, yo, you know. So to every night the cabaret thing down at the the great river the, the river thing. Right. So him get exposed to the band thing and the type of music thing that we never know. So yeah, so him did musical as a virgin, you know? So we start learn about him now, so we start click. So me and start click and we never really play together yet. Then you have a thing named Sinbad Soul Festival. When he came to Jamaica. 
They had it at Jared Park. And then they have the after parties at Pier 1 and Margaritaville. Now, at the time, we didn't well in demand. Yeah. Kick off Pier 1 and Pier 1. I grew up Pier 1 and become stapling up Pier 1 now. Margaritaville home. Mar Margarita, Margaritaville was a seafood restaurant before it was like a seafood and lounge and mm. whatever, you know? Them refurbish and then put on the sports bar thing. So they had a manager, entertainment manager and all of that, named Yanni. Can't remember his name because a good dude. He didn't give me enough break. So Yanni reached out to me and I said, Yo, the vibes that we have up here on Friday. But I oh, love the vibes that on Saturday. Oh. Margaritaville, nobody know about Margarita. They just start start now. There wasn't a club, there was just a sports bar. Seafood restaurants and sports bar. So and I said, alright. So I start this side, alright, I'll try it out. And I said, Mobi, yes, I would have sat there now. You know. Villa is a new spot. I used to have a club named Cave down at Sea Wind. You know, the, you know the hotel that used to run the Saturday, but Margarita will come now. So I start them I am and start play. No what what I used to do was they never have a sound on them thing there. Mm. I used to bring my, my bass box, bring my arms and string up and use them house, and bring my turntable and put them on two stool like this, and just find a little spot, and just make it. Fire. And, bro, remember me have a pair one on the place. Oh, we talk about black can come in. They have Margaretaville, have the tourists and become the hot spot. It's like Margaretaville was like a spring break, spring break every week. Mm. That's why it was wild because it yeah. was a young tourist spot and they have the slide and all of them new style at the time. So they, and then they bust it at a, at a spring break time. So you know they have the influx of, of college students. So they, mm. you know, and we have the hip hop vibe and the thing we did at Guanca. We play a pier one, so we know. Bro, that starts every Saturday. So, so Friday night, I match up here one Saturday, I match up here. I'm still busville now as a new spot. I'm just gonna beat it for about one, two, three months till the bus. Let me go there one week and see them start me. DJ boot. Mm. And it turn Margaritaville. You can tell us some youth that come out of Margaritaville every time when we make it. When I shell Margaritaville and I do it. Them time a DJ Nico just started work at Margaritaville. Nico. Nico wasn't a DJ. Uh -huh. Nico wasn't a DJ. Nico was a, a, a playmaker. Playmaker. Like people uh, entertain and do enough contests and oh, okay. that's what you see. Vice man, that's yeah, vice thing. man. That's what you see. Bad with the mic. Yeah. Enough people don't understand. Oh, okay, cool, man. All right. So I just saw we I just saw me meet like Nico and and you like Shine DJ Shine that a red rat bigger brother. They were like the DJs and I used to name Tony Mental. We just call him so can smoke enough Mataran, like Mataran. Oh, okay. And I say, yo, you name Mental. We never said Tony. We just, he used to name Tony, but we used to just say, yo, Mental. mental. I'm calling him Mental. And he used to be, he didn't come be the top man when they talk about game and shelly place and us have. Play fun. Yeah, and the youth them grow. So till them have to start play. Mm. And, and Margarita will now was a tourist place, and Margarita will sign up to promo only and get. Every song with a pop. So all the Britney Spears them and the in sync them at that time. Did it? Yeah, we have everything. Everything we would have seen on TRL and Rap City are as a youth. Did it? Yeah, we have every song, bro. At, so we into it. And I saw we are at the place and do the party them and Ville Bus and then you have a thing named a man come with a boat from Kingston. Named Jamaica Queen. One party boat, first party boat. Come appear one at a dock. They say to stay. And him come and him ask about DJ. See? And the people them say, yo. The only you me know can bust this boat here. Lipo. Yeah. Cause that was the name. Mm, DJ Lipo. I can't remember the man come and meet with me. And I say, yo, they recommend you and came up on the boat. That was the first Denon, Den, Denon, Denon CD player ever seen. In a Moby and I right, first Moby. one, near C. See? But I did start, I did familiar with CD because I used to buy CD right. singles. Mm. I used to get the CD single then with the radio edit and come here, you know, I used to like that, to keep my own collection. And the man said, yo, both come from Miami fully set up in a party. Sound on it already, everything brand new, DJ boot, everything. 
waterproof of waterproof lighting bar upstairs. And I say, how many did a boat now? CD alone it have, and then time the island, the top music not the pan CD. Vinyl, see me. Vinyl. All right. I'm a creator style, and the man them say, yo, you're great. You also make the mix of the boat, pre-mix it exactly how I know it to go. Can remember you know, I know the people them are lead me you know. Yeah, I lead the people them. Yeah. Exactly. So from me make the mix, me I lead the people them exactly how the mix go. Me know the big song. Me know where it to go pull up. It to go pull up exactly. <laughs> Bro, believe yeah, me, Billy I, dance if you, you can go dance. more beer, right? No, me Billy right in, in, in the music room, I pure one, because I never leave this so yet, you know. Yeah, never leave this up. No, I never leave this so. Sometimes the man used to watch me make it, and I say, watch how this take the whole place, the whole boat sink later. I man say, look at it, it's easy. <laughs> I said, no, 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 me. I make me segment them. Me hip hop. Mm, just my like I'm doing some creator now, Pan. Yeah. Mm. I make the segment them hot. They say, I say, I come in segment, and the boat come in, they say, tat them. Ask them. Bro, I used to have more people on the, on the dock who can't go on the boat than what they're on the boat. Coast Guard used to come out of, out of the boat at night time and say, yo, the boat there below be the line. You know. Too much people. <laughs> Too much people. Bro, I used to ram the boat so till mm. them have to start the tow trip. Because the amount of people who come from the boat and hear about the boat, I said, no, we can't leave them and see. What we'll do our next trip? Do our next trip, flip up. Yeah. See? Then time you know, solar thing, see me next yes, but start bring some youth around me now. Start bring some youth around me, like youth named TC, used to work at pieces and pieces let him go. But I'm a youth guy, well, we are a family from pieces. Some of us say, yo, not go too far, stay right us. And then you have a, net, have a youth named Baby Tug now, when I me, when me bring and Baby Tug is second youth. I'm a, you know the first youth I'm a bring? DJ Flavor, who I producer right now. Flavor? Yeah. See? I tell you how I bring in flavor. I'm interested in a radio. So I go to Mr. Russell one day in my office. And I say, Mr. Russell, I me, me like radio, I'm interested. I would like a chance to go over at one or two, because at the time you were part, part owner. Mm, oh, okay. And I use that as my advantage, because I know that. So I say, Mr. Russell, I'm interested in like radio, I would like a chance to go over at one or two, go watch and see how but them time the barge was there. Motty Perkins was there, Winston Williams, Ron was there, Bones was there. DJ Bones. Yeah. See? And him called the manager, I can't remember him, Mr. Chung was in here. Very good manager, I mean, I was a Chinese man. And him said, yo, send him in, man. I'm going to go over there, I'm going to sit down in my office and meet him, and I said, what's your story? I said, I'm just interested in the radio. At the time, he knew, he knew, he knew I was the DJ for Pier One and I said, yes. all right, yeah, my musical, you know? And I said, all right. And make them make it be known. So whenever you see him security, just let him up. Like like an internship at the time, you know? So I me, me ask him one internship. <laughs> <laughs> like for real, bro. See? So I ask him one internship. Get the permission and I start go up there. Like I leave Pier 1 and the 6 or sometime I just hear somebody and I say, yo, I'm going to watch this. Barry G, I'm going to watch him at 2 o'clock. They go stand up and yeah. watch Barry G. In the studio with Barry G. Mm. See my do the request show, see my did him call and learn how Barry G do him thing. Barry G was a man who bring him old, him old music library comes put in his studio. So I learned from that so if you have everything with you all the while. You couldn't ask Barry G if you had sang on him. Now. Yeah. He not know he not, he not different part of the radio station. But he might use it too. But he might have him own big catalog of things, B C D B record, everything. Thing and I had full up P exclusive thing and I say yo so some style learn say yo if you have, have my thing you know have, you know I start to have my own catalog and so because I get the permission now I used to go over there and spend Saturday afternoon go listen to Ron or Bones Ron used to play earlier like two Was to six yeah Ron Mushet yeah man all of them come from the same well, I see him school so I used to go over there and walk in a ranch one and used to like watch him, you know? Because Ryan was a man, you know, him talk, you, you listen, yeah. and then play some song and thing, you know? So I used to just go over there, but I never used to bring no record. Mm. I used to use them, and I used to play like old, the old school disco, them like, tin, 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 forget me not. The same thing, the eight is. So I used to mix, because I never used to mix them, I used to just cross. And mm. So me, there, you know, I said, yo, your mother can't play them, so. 
as a mixer. Because we, as a mixer, you can't hear music now, mix. Right. So I say, oh, I'm here and go on top, man. I start mixing our show, so tell him, you say, yo, Lipo in the belly, I got Lipo from Pier 1, the next set. You know, I used to stay over now. Bones now used to have the show, the 6 to, six to 12. The afternoon, the Friday and Saturday. That was more hype on him. Big slap that Yeah, time. the new thing. Mm. He used to juggle. So I say, eh, start going there now. Link up with bones and start. To the point where I start bringing record box go back. I used to have the 12 inch team. I used to play a prayer when I have the radio edit. I oh, hip hop okay. them and thing. And I saw, I bring my music. Bones used to talk and I start mix. So I tell him, say, yo, why don't I start to come up every Saturday and thing like how Mr. Chung say, all right and thing. And I say, eh. So I start go up every Saturday now. So I start going there and one thing and thing. So I call. Master Wayne. Yeah. <laughs> I say, Master Wayne, you are going. I don't know two things that are going. Forward with me. <laughs> See? And so I win. And you can't win going out. Yeah, one or two. I mean, I win. I mean, tell him, say, yo, come here, I can go up at the. The thing I can me over the first. Yeah. And I said, Wizard. So I remember some I'm link up from the clash and we are linked. Mm. But me alone used to go over the to me ask Mr. Russell for my own because I were, were curious about it. And I tell him, yo, come in. I will link up and when Bowen said, Fleet Morris, man, I said, Oh, get away, Morris to come play you. And I said, everything, Chris. <laughs> and the travel link up bones was it. The man with the talking and the vibes. And me and DJ we know. And mix. Mix and play and people I say, yo, this bad, this show you bad. So it was DJ Lippo, Bones Master Lippo, and DJ Bones. right? You used to name Triple Threat. Tri a triple Threat. Every Friday triple. night house party. You used to have a yeah. jingle with General B giving him Bones Lippo Master Wayne. <laughs> yeah, jingle. You know what I was signature jingle at the time. And I saw with Jelly in and start this radio thing now. So me used to curious and go over the radio before showtime. Bones and used to have a big bag, all about beer records. So I used to run through the record them. But through me, I run the road now. Me, I said, beer, it really, my beer thing. What the man and I look here. Yeah. So I start sort them out. Oh, God, right. Yeah, and start play them in the show now. So that what I start doing now. I don't know what kind of buzz it start at Casa Kingston. What we don't know about as some more beer youth. Because remember when I oh. do the show at more beer with the other thing. Yeah. Really, they all over, man. So you know, no, say Delhi ranks. Drive come a mobile. And I say, yo, I drive from mobile if you come meet them youth one name. But I don't even know say them are my shop town. Yeah. I know but they don't know them yet. Yeah, who they youth? So Delhi ranks get me number and call me. And I meet him up. Delhi ranks first. I say. So them time I know me, I said to myself, I say. Ah, this I come from town. From Link Up. Cause you know the business go at the time. The business they are town. The business, yeah. I say artists are come from town for Link Up. That means that thing I go on, man. So I agree with Delhi one day. So he say, yo, why you not come town one day, man? I will link up and we'll go to them and we'll get some tune. So I saw me learn this whole new tune thing from day one. So Delhi start bring me go at Dynamics now and the distributor them. So I start getting the music before the record shop. Because that is what the record shop used to do. Or back in the day, some producer would produce and distribute their own music. They used to mm. drive around a record shop and, and sell you. Right. Right. Before I would have turn, take my bus. You don't know. Kick out early, take my coaster bus. Come off at three miles. And then they'll meet me out at three miles. And you know, I start carrying me around. I can't tell you one of the first who to carry me around was Sabatooth. Sabatooth. Really out. And then the Sabatooth have a song named Holy Man and Holy Feet. And we used to play it, I don't know him. Yeah, we used to just run through record boxes, as I tell you, and just play a song. And people, you know, for the youth, they say, we are playing them song. I don't know them. We just like music, love music from them time, and just play music. So, then they bring me up, bring me on, and I say, yo, I'm the on the radio. And start bringing me around, you know, Dynamics, Arrows, you know, the whole flex. So, I start see the whole flex and start meet artists you now, and start know the studio them you now, and, you know, start see the flex. So, I'm intrigued by it. I start forward up every week. Yeah? Yeah. So, during them time, you know, I did have a girl from Mobile who transferred to the UA thing. Fortunate enough, so boy, she, for her people, they have it like that. So, she did have, have a place. She did have an apartment, was like one of the first people who have a, a place at Wellington. Mm. So, I used to forward up and sometimes <laughs> spend time with her. 
Yeah. Use a, them a time. Line up, yeah, yeah, that's the best that talk the truth. A good lineup. When, when Dell invite me up and I used to spend my time and go around and pick up song. I used to can't stay over all the three days because my girl up here. So I spend the night then with her and touch the road. That's how I get ex exposed to the whole cactus vibes and vibes like that. Because I start stay over now. So I start see some of the town vibes in the week. Cactus and Mirage and you know what I mean? But Cactus to me was one of the biggest vibes. Yes. Cause club rap you can't do raps until you can't go in. <laughs> and that is like every Wednesday. And as a as an artist sometimes if you have one song. You want to play in a cactus. You want to play, but the, the love where you get back in them time as an artist. For you, you want song you can sing that the, your confidence is gonna be. Because the love you get whenever right. you have a song of them place there, I'm gonna say, yo, you bust up cactus last night, you can't go back to the studio with that. I'm, he, the artist will go back to the studio with that the next day and be a dub because he sang it a big forward. He, he never had a record a song them time to forget a bad song. So you have, so art, have, so have artists who have bad song where a dub plate already. Dub plate. And it starts running road already. So a producer just hear it and I'm gonna say, yo, you know advice. You know, you know advice teach him. You have the bad song where running dub where every sound man. So you see by the time the record, knowing it's a hit song already and then you get a hit producer with a hit rhythm. Gone, gone. Yeah, so them time when I want, when I hear when a man say, yo, yo, steal the voice me, you know. You just humble so. Because steal them rhythm, them rhythm no miss. Yeah, miss. Your boss, worldwide, everybody has got play it and you know, it's like a notch up. So them them thing that school me, I've big up Delhi Ranks and Sabato. Because them and the boss me. In a town. I mean, have to big up Miss Rose from Arrows and Father Bill Car. Them show me enough things in our music and really give me a blight as a youth where dub plate and you know get enough dub, dub and song for me while me there are more be where, where me couldn't get it and you know them play a very important role in a grooming me and teaching me that part of the game when I was at, at 102 and you know the learning process there. Yes. So at 102 now. We said Lippo, Master Wayne and Bones, Bones are running after The trio. Zane? Yeah. At this trio on radio at the time. Yeah. But then Zip came into the picture. How that come in? Zip never come into the picture yet. Zip not come in yet? At 102 decided to change a format. That's out of the blue. Yeah? To go retro. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, for me, my, my purpose of being on radio was to make it my mark and like doing what I say the greats them do before. Like boss artists and boss song and because you know me I do that from Pier One and love right. the new music pieces and all of that. So, so we decided to say, yo, we're not going to work with it, you know. We're going to left. Oh. So me and DJ went and say, yo, we can't work with this. Because we want to make a name, we want boss some artists. The thing that we do, we love it already. We don't want to change. I'm going to play all this. So it's like, Young, young roots. Yeah, you know? <laughs> the artist thing, them now we go on old school. Yeah, man. We, we don't have nothing against old school, you know, but the mission where we end up on that wasn't a, a part of it. And sometimes you have to just know, say, yo, you have to know your mission. You have to know your mission, brother. So we know our mission, despite the hype and everything and being on radio. Being on radio wasn't being on radio doing what we want to do and making our mark. So we decided not to. So me and DJ went and said, boy, boy, Bones, you can't manage this. You can't complain about all this. Sorry. The other thing that we are dealing with. And we decide for boy up out. Take on back the road. Terrible. Because you don't know we go up on the road now, so we have a different name, different momentum. Mm -hmm. So we take on back Mobile, different momentum. So we take on Pier 1 now and start building the Wednesday night thing, which become bigger than the Friday night. Because we used to do the fashion show now with Peter right. Bill, And then me alone play all night. No. I mean, so the Friday night when I had me and pieces and fracky them. Mm. Wednesday night was just me, it was just my vibe, my everything. Start play from 9 o'clock. Until it's done. And I mean, I use that and unite Mobile. Yeah? Yeah, we made the uptown and the gangs them and everybody done with the war. Party vibes. I want to come up here one. I want to come up Ville. I want to come up here. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, we use that now and yeah. use that and unite Mobile. We make the gangster them, the renegade, the piranha, and then you start come up here one. Night town. 
So even you know, they are kind of Yeah, man, them. I mean, them you, they grow and we just make peace. And the man, they start party you now. When they talk about boat and man, I so. And you know, we just start be the youth them. When they're looking at Mobi after a period of time, there's no poster when I have lip or in excess. Yeah? None. But out, out run the sound thing. Out run the sound Yeah, thing. like become like the artist, mm. you know? Literally. Because my mama build Margarita Ville. And then I grew from Pier 1 to I build my own night at Pier 1. And then I have the boat. Which there were, the, them thing was the Jamaica tree. Queen. Yeah, the, them thing was the tree every week thing. I'm up here. Yeah, you know me here down there, man. Yeah, so, <laughs> so I start the, the boat now. The boat get away now. And I say, take on the you. I mean, select them now. Mm. And I say, alright, I'll build a little team. I'll build a team, I'll build a boat, I'll build a boat, I'll build a boat. And I say, yo, more money. And the boat, them, I say, yo. I'm not paying no more money. And I say, yo, remember, I say, every night I walk down here, yeah, it's dark full. And, and nobody not go up on the boat there until they see me. Nobody. I me can't, me can't tell her that. And I say, yo, all right. Them people don't know say we have it. And I say, yo, team, we are defend more money. Remember, so when I do the boat, I was me alone and I take one on. Every night, I have to share all of my money with you. So I have to get more money for pay. You know. So I start doing with them. I make them know what I do. And I say, all right, DJ, anything you say. And I say, hear me, I say, Jamaica Queen, Mr. Roberts, if I can't give it this or now, we can't do the boat. And I say, yo, we have the boat locked. We don't need you. It's rare. <laughs> I stand back. I said, we're not under the boat. And get the boat two weeks. The boat sink. And the third week, <laughs> nobody in the panic dock. Yeah. I remember, we have Pier 1 on our Wednesday. So when we don't shell the whole Pier 1 and the people, they say, yeah, we're not under the boat. And I said, remember when we under the boat again? <laughs> we're not doing for sabotage, but at the end of the day, we know we were as a youth and you have to stand up on it. And from day one, we stand up on, on them things there. Despite the hype and what, what are going mm. And the boat, and try to fight, nothing dark, empty, nobody not out there. People them say, no sir, if I'm liquid, them, I'm not, if I'm lip them, I'm not going to pan a boat. I will prove it. And I'm coming, and I will negotiate, and I will say, all right, cool. Wednesday, people, <laughs> boat this Sunday. Mm. Boat full again. Two trip. Yes. we could have make. <laughs> yeah. We never need two or three weeks to build no momentum. The fans just say, yo, all right. Sunday, boat. Boat ready again. I remember, we never, we nah. It's not like, me, me fell up, co worker them who get the job. I will bridging them who get it. Mm. Because I don't know when I fall, when I drop off I drop on shoulder, as them say. But then just can't sail the boat. But I don't, I don't feel the, remember them when they come party with we, and them happiest time. Mm. So them know, say, yo, although we have it, and them dog are thinking of. And them just accept that, teach them, and let you go again. And so when them let you go again, man, until me come turn. Yeah. Yeah, I kept it. Yeah, man. <laughs> and we, go, we go through bad times, because there were times when the hurricane come. I mash up Pier 1. We don't have no Wednesday. Because Pier 1 mash up and you don't know them place. They are a big place. I'm a wait for insurance. And Pier oh, 1 did a wait for insurance. That the, take a while. The dock them mash up so the boat, can't. boat them can't yeah. sail. Mm. See? And then we decide. Remember I say in, in that, during that time we decide so we don't play all this. So I just road. Me and DJ win them and in excess. And just them. I, I generate the whole energy from. So in, during that time, slow me down. You understand? Yeah. Of all my girl them time, they have all flight attendant and girl and you don't know how thing go. All love go. All love go. Yeah. Up and down and rough <laughs> and rough and soft and nice and good. And yeah. Yeah, you know what I mean? Settings, man. Yeah man, and you know we start at rough time cause different times now things I'm not like it used to. Mm. But during the time I can't say big up to her cause at the time she played an important role cause at the time she was so instrumental and interested in everything and you should have find where every record shop there. Yeah, support. In, in any city. 
and keep me loaded with the foreign yeah, music yes. and the thing that I always want to keep me fresh to death. So you see it from <laughs> 106 to the, you guarantee you go to Pier 1 tonight. Yeah, go hear it. In my plate. Because, you know, she used to fly like three times a week. So that, you know, I always have me have new music. So I have to big her up. Mealy Bug. You know, Moby and Noir, it wasn't a secret. Mealy Bug, big Yeah, man, big up Mealy Bug. You know, she played for her role. And, yeah, man. You know, that was the team during that time. And as, as I tell you, the, the, the whole hurricane and them thing there. So we're there, Moby and Noir, I say, what we are doing? So at the time, RFM reached out to DJ Wayne. Because RFM used to listen to me from Atano too, when I go on with this. Yeah. Song. You know, he used to know all Mr. Young. Because. So we know Mr. Young from that time, and he said, Yo, no boy, I give me trouble. But people don't know that, because he used to call me, I'm cool. Because I'm cool like that. He must say, Boy, the thing get rough, you know. I don't know the hurricane and thing. And so Mr. Young called Whistle. And DJ went and said, boy, I said, link me, because I remember me and him around right. time. Not now hide. I'm a brethren. I said, yo, DJ, I said, young. I said, Irene, come check him. And I said, so I said, all right, cool. So I said, yeah, come. I said, no, but I said, you are him, call. I said, no, man, come on. Remember so I said, tell if you come with him. Remember I two of you, you know. I said, all right, cool. And we go and thing, and at the time, going to the office, two of you, I meet and thing, and I said, young, I said, Jano, I know the two of you, know, I want to do nothing, you know. But I want my want right now. Oh. I mean, I say, all right, Mr. Young, everything cool. So during that time, I was like, I remember the same all night studio. I roll the same way every day. Every day. Because we know what time I come. So I say, boy, I work on something so needy, I just go on easy. But I'm Mr. Young. Yeah. Mm. I'm just there, I go on work and I do my thing. I'm going to start. Because Wednesday thing, I also have a little young artist thing. Oh. So from there, so I start DJ. Yeah? Yeah, so I used to make young artists them all, all I freak and Meritali, all of them people that DJ. Africa. Yeah man, ask her about me. <laughs> I freak big up herself. We used to have a Wednesday talent thing, and we used to make all of the talent them in the mobile. DJ. Sing, okay. like for two hours, everybody, one or two songs, if your body get a pull up on your thing, and then me juggle. And I saw come, used to DJ and play around, so the man said, yo, you know how voice and song like Lippo? And I used to voice them and dub play it, like for the son of my mobile and for myself and play them. Yeah? Yeah, I'm used to always a DJ. My record during that time, I'm going to jam to uh, Jazzy T record. Me to. True Blue did record. Me to. I have record meaning record from big juggling. Yeah, man, I have some song I'm going to be on just record and play. So, as many people probably think, the, 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 the artist thing come later and I think a long time ago. Uh, from, yeah, from every Wednesday, I'm used to DJ. If it's me put up some picture of me a DJ all the while, I was yeah. a DJ. Yeah, I just host it and I DJ. I'm, you know, yeah, so from them time there, I always like it. And a DJ and Delhi them used to come here and hear me and I said, Dad, you know, I do a song. So from them time, a Delhi used to encourage me. Delhi so did it for a long time. Yeah, a Delhi made me record the first song after when I transformed into liquid and come yeah. down. I him, him draw me out back in that time. So anyway, now, we reached down. Bang, bang. Mr. So Young called me now and said, DJ, when tell you, call your boy. Tell him to come check me. Because Mr. Young was a real man, I saw him talk. Yeah. Tell him to come check me. So I go check him. Up a watch him. Time like this, because them time I go over there. Evening time. So I go check Mr. Young and I'm familiar with me already from the first meeting. So I say, I'm ready for you now. So I say, what do you mean, Mr. Young? I say, I'm ready for you, I'm ready for you now. You know where you live at town? <laughs> so I say, no, I don't know where you live, chief. You know where you live. There's nobody at town. I say, well, I say, I'm at town. Ready at town now. So I say, all right, cool. I say, yo, go up as Dermo Road Zip. Ask for Judith. Judith Badly. Badly. Tell her some send you. So at the time, I kind of did familiar with Judith from Fame, because Fame wrote through them always right. come on Moby and Pier One, and we was like a DJ, we were well popular. Sometimes we guess pan, pan it and So them, Judith, them know about it from that one or two. So I say, all right, me and DJ went go. So boom and journey out. Yeah, I was to come in. Yeah, nobody else no know. Not even okay. my mother or family. Nobody. I said, where's the uh, Irish? And we link him up, uh, link up uh, and come up at uh, town. And me and him in a Judith office. You know, and Judith I say, talk to me and whatever. And we we'll talk to her and thing and she say, so what name you gonna use and lip and I say, you wanna change your name? And I say, yeah. And she said, to what? And I say, I have a name, you know. It's a gimmick's name, but I feel like I'm going to use it now because 
When I do Sinbad Soul Festival, the Yankee DJ them used to make the mistake by calling me Lipo and say, Liquid. Oh. And my bread, you know, appear one, Mr. Bullins now, top chef from day one, used to gimmicks me. And I said, Why am I liquid? And I said, Yo, I'm going to name some man. Lipo, man, my name, man. <laughs> so I yeah. so always use so tell me just use to stop and sign. Mm. So I come zip. And she said, You have a name? A liquid name. That's how it came back. And I said, yo, I got to use the name there. And she said, why the name? And I said, liquid. And at the time, Zipper alias driven. Mm. And she said, yo, perfect. And I said, yo, the name there. And she said, yo, how oh, you that explain it? And I said, yo, I play, I play anything. I play every genre, anything. Wedding, stage show, party, because some of the train from Mobius. So I could have played any, anything, play every genre. And she said, yo, that makes sense. And I said, yeah, man, that's why I use it. And from there, so. Liquid musical, man. And from there, so. Liquid band. ZJ. Nobody, I'm going to be in a no say I'm a liquid. But just go back, drive, go back, I'm going to be. Because Judith said, you yeah, start Friday. I'm going to meet with her the Wednesday. I'm drive, go back, I'm going to be. Pack up my record, I'm going to call my bridge and talk. I'm alone. I'm up the same way. I'm going to go to my yard to my mother and my grandmother and say, Mommy, get a job, you know. But I'm going to be. The radio station at town. And my grandmother said, So, where you gonna live? Where you gonna do? And I said, I don't know, you know. <laughs> I don't know where I gonna live. I never know where I live. Yeah. But I just say, Yo, you want me to learn from Atton or two? And me go back in the radio you now. I go, All right. Me at... The risk, I just deal with it. Because I know it up here. And I roll out with my car. I record them alone. I record them at night. I want to bag with some clothes. And I can remember my computer. My mother buy me the computer, the big up my mother car, the computer there. Everything I remember could have start as liquid. Because when she bought me the computer back in the day in Mobile, I started learning sound forge and I started learning acid. And I started learning for remix. And change song pan rhythm and then I start download be a fine music pan Kaza. Cause Kaza used to be the download no, thing. Kaza, man. See? Whole night you just set the thing for download and a man in the come see. So I see a song pan BT. Casa, clean version or whatever. So, so I used to start building my MP3 catalog. But after I get the job, I go back to Mobile. I link one of my brethren, Godfather. He named DJ Murdoch. <laughs> See? He was the first DJ, DJ who had a full computer sound at the time. Okay. So, he did have everything for MP3. From and I wet them and they deal with so you know, everything him, clean, everything soul. So I him link, link me up and him said, DJ, I'm gonna make a cup of my drive. And my other virgin was a, a was a MP3 fanatic at the time, mm. funky. And him give me some DVD with be everything while I run the place. And me get the me get the sixties come all the way up to the time to the two thousand. Two when it comes in. Like yeah, and me did have built too. So with my bridge in them, what, what me did I play with? Me leave my record box give them. Everything. Because I said, dog, I can't take my record box because I still have use it. And I still have to eat. And I left me. See, baby talk, Kentucky. Same DJ Kentucky. He's a part of my crew them time there. Yeah. Big him up. You don't know a great DJ right now mm -hmm. from the school. I leave my record box with them. Record, Baby Tug still have my record box. Baby Tug still play at Pier 1 right now. I'm the, I'm the main DJ for Pier 1, same way. You understand? And Baby Tug came in to play when I decided to start go do the radio show with Bones. Mm -hmm. And I play at Pier 1 and I say, yo, you're not come over here until 12 o'clock. We need somebody for your play. So I so yeah, so, yeah, teach him how to play mm -hmm. everything. And I give him all the name, Baby Tug. And yeah. You feel me? All of that work into play and, and I saw that I just start, you know, from there so I just start grow. Come while coming to town with DJ we and see me, we still start coming to town when we do the Ari thing. And arrows and we. Mm. Come a Renaissance same way. We used to come more and so we meet Dan. Cause Dan cause we used to record doublet. I want the Wayne Marshall them and that's how Wayne Marshall used to vice. Mm. Up town. So I so saw we meet Dan Carleon in Upper Mona. And meet Cartel. And the whole of that. So Dan was the dub plate king at the time, and you know, Cartel and Marshall, them and everybody around the place. Bling Dog and everything. Vendetta. 
<laughs> yeah. yeah, Dan had the, Dan had the original Vendetta sound. Mm. We know this not the Vendetta. Yeah, man, man, that's Dan had the, the Vendetta sound. Sound, right. You don't know how Kalina had the artist Vendetta and Vendetta thing. Boss. Yeah, yeah, respect right. to all of them. And I saw now, I meet Cartel and I saw me start record, I dub them and I think them for zip. And you know, I meet Addy them and Marshall them, anything more want them time they them record and at the time Dan say, Dan decides to say, start production. Yeah. And come up with it. The mad dance with him at the time. Mad dance. So you know, me and DJ went out with G and all the way I work together. And we roll with the rhythm and kick it out. We roll with the mad dance rhythm and kick out. And we bust. So, so you always uh, push yeah. out mad dance? Yeah, because we were a team, same time. We never stopped being. Oh, so even do him the Ari and you Even the Ari, me, yeah, we just decided to say, yo, Ari, yo, you have Ari, me have Zip. And that's how we work. We, the same team, but the only thing we did a different, different place. place. We right. never stopped being a team at the time. You understand? We decided to say, yo, we have changed enough things. We come juggle like we. We learned some four and have them advantages, so we start edit song. And some song we never see up on the radio, we never have edit. Mm. And we edit them. And start playing them and make a juggling different. So we'll play some song. We say, yo, the man I play like a dance with the dog. <laughs> so that is where that came from. Yes. By bringing the real street hardcore mixed the with radio. the mainstream to the radio. Mm. So everybody, the uptown and the middle, I get something. That was just our style. And we mix it with dub plate too. So the, we have the dub plate juggling to all of the hot song, them everything new. And we start that juggling. And we start to look up. And I can remember Dan and make rhythm. And Danny never have effects CD in the studio. And DJ when I run through it, because we always like effects. I would start effects on radio. Yeah. And DJ when find the, the Beethoven. Because enough people don't know what the sound that is. It's Beethoven. Oh, cool. Alright. That sound was to signify when it was a big song. Anytime you hear, we are saying, yo, this song you are it, it can you hear, -na -na -na. you hear with the drop. The artist is tell us, yo, yo, we get the pen and the air, it can't. It's like how <laughs> Funk Flex you also have the bomb. Yeah. You know, you drop the bomb by your thing, you it. Yeah, for a man say, yo, we get the pen and the air. Gone, the song gone. Gone. See it? I mean, you know, I start building my thing as if. And then the production thing coming to play DJ when go so boom, and after that, Drop sec in second rhythm, which was crazy. Crazy, that it. Why are you doing it? Why you doing it? Yeah. And them team up with blacks at the same time and drop at Egyptian. Girl go so, mmm, -hmm, sweet to the belly. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm the curious because from them time, from before, I'm the other one or two, I mean, I move around Delhi because Delhi used to do the production in the time right, there. Right, right. See, big up Delhi because I'm boss me at the production thing first. I mean, also watch and when I'm going to do the production thing, you know? With steely them on, or him go vice, or I remember, you know, I'm up, I mean, I roll it right through, you know, anyway, they are there with the Sabatoon at the time. You see me? So, some learn the production thing, somebody well curious and well love it long time, I want to do it. And then I meet Dan, them know where I do it from scratch, and mm -hmm. I start learn. You know, you, them in my age group, where you can understand. So, then I say, yo, liquid, oh, yes, I say, yo, I'm ready, you know. So, I make a rhythm for me. Crazy eye. Crazy eye for them. So I said, oh, we have eyes. Be a thing. So at the time, then, we, at the time, then they made drop, fan the river, run the whole place. The dancing thing did around the place. Mm. Ellie Tour does come from foreign and link up with Cool Face as a man. Him and Cool Face always a ride. And we had to do the road at night time. We said, yo, new dance out there, you know, crazy eye. We eat around the place and chili belly them and be a thing. Cool Face. And put it together. And, that voice, assassin come here the rhythm. Girls gone wild. Girls gone wild. And you know, from there some of the star voice of the project, which my voice like about 25 songs. You have three cartel, it was like the first rhythm cartel, the three song pan. You know, big up cartel, Bunty Killer, yo, Lady Sa, Tanya Stevens, you name it, bro. Everybody up on the project. The first project that first project, worldwide hit. Everywhere we get to worldwide hit. Girls gone wild, crazy hype, classic. And I saw the production thing going on, you know, the whole team are work. As I said, it's them, it's them go down the line for that same way, the whole right. way. You know, grateful of that. So we continue to do the thing. The slow bunks was the follow-up rhythm, it. Then we do a rhythm named Hello Motor. 
Me I use my cellular. Dead girl regular. You know, that did work. Then we do. French vanilla. Man for dead. A man for dead. Hey not boy, a, hey boy, I'll be a trouble. Yeah, you know, I'm getting a chance. No, 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 no. Right, so the rhythm. Yeah. Would you advise for the rhythm before? All right, it's a rhythm I grew up with as a youth. It was one of my favorite rhythms, but them rhythm they never cross. Meaning them rhythm never never play mainstream because them right. songs they did raw. I am a bana, I am a live, I am a bana. Tanto di, hey boy, look up, you know the Uzi Terry Gansy, bad Terry, DJ. Right. Hot song and Bujid have a song on it name. Man for dead, come at them now when I save no lead. We used to love them as a youth. Mm. Come and buy them record and oh. love them. Rude boy Kelly label them time. That was Dave Kelly first set of production. Right. Dave Kelly first set of production. Right. Because that, that rhythm was before. Battery Rider rhythm. Right. Battery Rider was a mainstream rhythm now. Bust. Rude boy Kelly rhythm. label. Because remember record we buy you know. Mm. So. Because I met the rhythm because it was one of my favourite rhythm. So I met the rhythm. So you re, 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 the rhythm. Re, the rhythm. Oh, okay, so I never sample your sample. Nah, no, man. Because that's the same time. Man. Nobody doesn't know them all them time they either, man. Yeah. That's the same yeah. Because they did send a, a rhythm to zip them first rhythm and I did like it, but enough people never like it, but I kind of did see. The vision. It, yeah, with them, they were them thing. Mm. So because I meet them now, I'm, them reach out to me and say, yo, DJ, boy, everybody flap a rhythm, but. You, still, you, you give you love and say you like it and, and still uh, and so true that them reach out so I meet them. So one time now I reach back out to them and say, yo, I have an idea and I'm on producing on my next project. And I call them as it and play the song, Man for Them. And I say, yo, the rhythm I'm on, exact, same thing, not change nothing. And I say, all right, DJ. And the man they make two versions. See? One with a phrase and the original. And come link me, I'm going to say, boom, I'm listening to them. And I say, yeah, I know what I want. One of the phrase, bad button, I want. I want the organic, the real thing. See? And if two people vice panel with him the first, perfect and Teflon. Perfect. Yeah. Don't bother me. Don't yeah. Don't bother me. Eh, can yeah, him first, it give me a strength, see? But the rhythm them did really make it for Bojo because me and Bojo did all right, all the while. Okay, and Bojo always said, Look what you produce with my name, I'm getting a rhythm. But Link Bojo now and said, Bojo, this is the rhythm I have, you know. This is my advice upon you, you know. I can't remember after zipping. You know. But Link Bojo, one even like this. And I say, Liquid. But my advice upon the rhythm already. Right, because uh, everyone. Uh, man, man for dead. dead. But I say, I'm done. 90s that remember them sang they are raw bad man sang them never go mainstream if you never did a go a dance or a stone lover you would have never know you see me it's about you know you don't know mainstream was like browning and mm. so that's about me love the rhythm there so till you know there they are now vibe booba put it in the van and i said remember you heard me <laughs> start play it you know and then i listen to it then never to it you know vibe still because i'm in trouble in my idea <laughs> but today they are vibes. <laughs> and we and Bubba there and we are going to hold it harder car. It's always a good vibes when we and Bojo link up. It right. never you see me can't tell you that. Always a good vibes. So we did have vibes and we do my play and the reason I go on see me, but the reason kinda of turns song. So to have vibe me here, Bubba say, hey boy, hey boy, you're being trouble you and then I sing something. But you say, what is it? How would I go? And it done. You know, two of them start vibing. Nah, no, tell a lie. And, and, and like, like Bubba said, they have to talk to you, my dad. And Bubba just said, talk to me, they're going to come, talk to me. You see me, and I said, so the rhythm of place until the vibes, you know, this, you know the studio yard. Yeah. You know, and and Bubba just said, who oh, is the studio? And then they're going to the man them put in the rhythm. Honestly, the same day, same, same night. Same day. Same night. I have to tell you that, them things that I used to do. Because Bubba, one of the, the persons that were dropped, drama to music. When me hear Browning on the radio, it was like, yo, what the hell is, who is that? I always I listen to artists, but when me hear the song and the voice, it just made me, made me change and start listening to music, different than dance all. So my, one of my goals was to produce Bojo, definitely. And I accomplished that. Hey boy. Yeah, hey boy, hey boy, I sang it. And that was on his first Grammy nomination album. First, one? first, first Grammy nominee album. Yeah. And, for, and that song was also video game and a bag of thing. Yeah. Which video game is coming out again? When Grand I, when, Theft? Yeah, you ain't, a, you ain't a Grand Theft. Big up Bojo for that. Yeah, Bojo met that go on and he me know and link me up. Yeah. Yeah, man, I said, Liquid, game, what you said? I said, yeah, anything. And you know, it worked. And then we move on from Dessa. 
You know what I mean? Delhi discovers G Steven. Genius. Genius. Mm. Big ship. Yeah. Discover Genius. I did meet Genius already before. I did hear China and China did have a song. I said, China, I want to sing them. I advise the film. And China said, I nah, advise the film. I advise the film, brother. I said, I nah, advise to them. And they sang them. I want a hit a hit song. Because, yo, my ears don't play them. Yeah. My ears don't ramp them. And I said, yo, China, I hit song, I want that one. Then Steven, I can read him at the time. I'm cartoon and I see China go voice on it and send it in. I did bad. So I start playing it because I meet them, but I know them bad. So I play the cartoon with him and Delhi meet him and thing. I link him up. I say, I want to make rhythm with him. So they link up and I say, man, Delhi make Red Bull and Guinness. Red Bull and Guinness. Yeah, Red Bull and Guinness was that thing I used to drink in a club. I used to drink a quad Wednesday night because I know it's a whole other history again. You see me? We used to drink that in a quad. We yeah, start man. drink Red Bull and Guinness. Guinness. Yeah. While during the Bembe time and them time, the two. And we said, what are you here reading? Red Bull and Guinness. Soltex was the, the, the mic MC in an in a asylum. Soltex. I am, I am singing the song to him. Kilawa, can't the president bounce? I'd select that. Yeah. Yeah. He was the selector in an asylum at the time. So when I was a long time selector, I selector start dance hall. <laughs> select, I selector start dance hall. Yeah. Oh, I'm just telling you, yeah, yeah. 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 but I'm just making know that you were I was a selector. Yeah. I'm start chant and start DJ thing. Mm. I know artists can't start dance, artists start reggae. Yeah. Mm. Sound system and selector. Start dance. Start dance. So I know my history, I know where my thing I come from. Yeah. So no man can call me out of, out of this. Because I'm more relevant than enough who I try to call me out. Because we are the root height. Yeah. You understand what I did? But you don't know. So, link the genius and you don't know the Red Bull and Guinness kick off. And I said, Deli, oh boss, I work with him and I like him vibes. I'll make him the next, next project. So I said, Genius, I'll make the next project for me, which was 12 gauge. 12 gauge. Yeah. So that's our vice, Killer and Idonia. Another classic. From them, this we know one. Oh, oh. 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 <laughs> yeah. No, no. Feel me? <laughs> so during that time now, you don't know me have the thing named Fresh to Death. Fresh to Death. I take over a place. And Fresh to Death, Fresh to Death is not a buck up show. No one make people know. It's not a buck up. Fresh to Death is something I sit down and meds and say, yo, oh, something I do it. Fresh to Death meds was like this. Fame around the place on Wednesday. Old school. See? I have a place Thursday, Friday, Big A, them and mm. Mighty Mike. Zipper do a thing where I play every day. Everything every day. See? I play every day now. I say, I can't play every day as a DJ who is versatile. Right. can never play the same thing every day and the same style. I can't do it. It's just not in me. All if I do what I do, I have to break your rule. Right. Because I can't do the same thing. So, I made it to me and say, all right. DJ, when I bust the thing them on Friday, Colin Nines them and Kurt them have the whole weekend. I can't fight with them. GT have Thursday night with them at the dance hall. All right. Wednesday. I go first. Everybody. And if you don't want to hear old school, why you, don't, why you would mind hearing? Dance hall. And the freshest thing before Friday, like we would normally have to wait every weekend before the show them. See? So I say, oh, I'm going to jerk them now. <laughs> Start playing old school pan Tuesday. You rub out the Wednesday old school. I don't rub it out. I just give you a choice. <laughs> if you love the old school pan Tuesday. Yeah, a Tuesday there. If Wednesday old school is not so hot to you, I give you a choice pan Wednesday and get, and get you pan, pan, pan Wednesday. Mm. And I saw me design my thing. <laughs> so till I eat. I eat. I was consistent with it. Literally, every jingle, everything, all idea. I just hear some song and call it at them and say, yo, when you say this song, all them jingle and them things, I just design my thing every day. I try, every week, I try to come up with something fresh. And during that time, you know, fresh with that help fuel something where, I don't help fuel it, but I bust a new song. Right. I'm in a partial. Can I want at show. So, when Killer come out with that song, like, when Beanie come out with this song, where 
I start the angel and beat thing. Because I don't really talk about them things, but I am music yeah, why I talk about mm -hmm. the apartheid from my angle. When I get the song there, to play, and I said, Jano, kill our premium. <laughs> yeah, because back in the day, you know what I mean? As a selector, you don't want killer pre. You want alright with, with killer. And I said, man, killer good, but killer go pre me, but the song is bad, you know. Then catch your heart attack. We only just. Yeah. No, no heart attack. The one from the show time. Them attack both first. Oh. Boom, bang. The killer did answer. Yeah. And me drop the song and whole of Jamaica. I say, yo! You will premiere the song. Yeah, lick with your crazy. <laughs> I mean, I say, no, nah, I do nothing. Killer just can't answer now. Because I do her work, man, I don't know what I do. I just want yeah, music. I play, I play some song. Oh, I'm telling you, man, the next killer week. Yo, the next week, <laughs> TJ called me and say, yo, I have the killer, you know. I say, I <laughs> say, yo, a short time, I know. I say, people, remember me to tell you, know. I have the killer this week. <laughs> Jamaica said, I lie him, I tell. Because remember, you have internet around my thing. Internet right. can't leak my thing. Yes, so internet can't leak. Yes, so inter after me, he <laughs> may go up on YouTube or two little things. Because remember, all the places around them time. So, yeah, the whole place stick up. I stick up the whole Jamaica till about 5 40. Because <laughs> craft that, I learned that from Barry G. You talk about the artist part of your show from your start and your whole people. But you never tell them what. You talk about the artist part that you, you think, but you never tell them when you are going to drop it. But you always hype it up with every segment, and then feel like, yo, it's going to drop now. I learned that. <laughs> I may have one hot song, but when I did the one hot song, the whole show, all if you got PP, I say, yo, you play it, yo, you play song it, because the way I talk about it. Yeah. But it's just read a, 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 read read a, a trick. Craft, a read a craft. Yeah, man. So some of my craft, them, I reveal me, I reveal them now. <laughs> And that's understand how I yeah. me, me, me create buzz, mm -hmm. literally, and them things there. And one of the greatest things is to hear the song before, so you know how to enjoy it. I know how to hype it up mm -hmm. and keep the energy there. And you know what I mean? The production thing going on, going on. I don't know it right through. And 2010, I started the artist thing again. How that come about though? I know you also, you know, that be night at Mobius. The artist thing come about by me doing the. Dance all chart pan zip every Johnny Cole. with Johnny Cole. I'm always a DJ. So the man I'm always a said, Nicky, they know I say you're bad. Yeah, Johnny, Johnny also the said it and me, and me sing the song them. So I used to sing back all the vice them, all Richie Spice and something, because then the Richie Spice and the Atan, Jack Cure, everybody vice me. I do. And the man I'm say, yo, you know I say, you're bad. And then he called me. One day before I go to work, I say, Yo, I have a rhythm, I have a record. I write a song for you. Mm. Up in my yard, you know? Yeah. So about, about 10 o'clock, 10, 10, 11, I go link Delhi. About 10, 11 o'clock, I go link Delhi. Yeah. I say, Cool, I'll come link him, so I did. All right, since I say, I'm a voice. All right, finally. Mm. I'm going to link EG. EG have a rhythm and I listen to it, and he have a song when he want me to sing. Charlene Temple rhythm. Charlene Temple, you're right. So I I try to sing a song when I give me, but. Nah, I feel. Yeah, you write it. Yeah. I come and write it either. Like, I used to write when I was mm -hmm. hard. And I said, Delhi, you know, so I have a couple of styles. And then I have a style and I say, You're good with me. That, like the, the, the little slang there. Yeah, mm -hmm. good with you. Good with me. You know. All right, good with you. you know. The little slang there, you know. So I turn it in a song. And I say, Yo, Pretty you, girl. Yeah, pretty girl. Girl, bend over. Like a something drop. Do it, girl, do it, girl. Some of them looks like I'm a chat for the mic when I juggle. You see me? Because you used to make the song them mm. easy for me. Transformer, like a girl, me go do it with you and you go do it with me. And then I said, No, this bad. And I said, Yeah, man, I made this man. I work with me. <laughs> and the dog work with me and mix out. And we said, Send the weasel them and some people. Because I didn't tell DJ when they say I have no song or nothing. I tell them to send it out. And then come say, yo, you're a wizard, play the thing. I say, play what? <laughs> you send him, you really send him. Come here, I say, yeah. you really send him song, dog. You really send him. I say, yeah. I listen it and sat the man and wake up me here. Donovan Dacus. No, no, Donovan. My name is Radio 2. What them name them time? Where, where G them name? Garfield and me turn them. Garfield. Yeah. And I say, the man, I really love that song, yeah. 
So till you just a play, start play, start play. Sean is a used to say, Yo, you know, I'm one of vice, yo. I'm used to tell him, Nah, I'm nah, not doing the artist thing. I just finish my show in the evening and see Mr. G them down there with Sean is and say, Yeah, man. Yo, we come for this evening, man. I think when I hear Delhi song, <laughs> but you don't have vice, we have vice here. Yeah. I say, Cool, I don't drive. I'm going to go with them. I'm going to go on there. One day of vice. They read him the vice in a one day, you know? that's why I name him. So, you know? One day? Yeah, the whole juggling. So all I, all I juggling vice now, yeah. one day. You hear me, I say? One well, day. Yeah. Uh, the car go When me go down, the car go left, being the vice already. Sean is the vice already. Mr. G vice already. I'm the last vice. One day? Yeah. And one twins day. have twins. Eh, eh, eh. So I go down there and the man say, I'm, you know, me hear the rhythm and I go on vibes. But I did go down a town. Some weekly thing. See? Go out and dance. One of them weekly Tuesday dance. Half wall time. And the girl let me down there, the girls them I should say. I stand up and push out them leg and so I'm there I'm outside, you know. So I say, yeah, I wanna stand up, so what can I stand up that? Them girls stand up. Yeah, so the one of the girls said to me, say, oh, them girls stand up, what are you? And she start and then I say, yeah, we like it. But I have it in my head mm. at that time. So I'm going to share this with them now. The rhythm, the rhythm of a, a, a pre-four. So I say, what more sing on this? So I'm in there like a demo and I say, look, where you going? Where you going? Because we have to build a song. So I say, them girls stand up. Them girls stand up. Because you know me a selector. So you know we know if you turn them things there. Right. Yeah. And the man say, yo, that bad, what that? What that mean? And I say, yo, you know, you know, know. but the girl, the girl them we know. Yeah. And I sing the lyrics. And my lyrics stand up on, in a dance still. Why if you walk out of me, you have to stand up. Oh. Me never have the O United. Oh. Record it. And, and you know? When I do like the, the back up, when I tell me, I say, oh. And the man say, yo, the O, the bad. Remember, one O, I say. And then low pitch. And Sean is them, take the O, them, and put them different. Mm. And the song come out, you know? To be honest, me is a youth more, I don't look for my thing. Sometimes I don't want to hear myself. If I say I have an interview with teacher, I don't want to watch about myself more. I can't tell them. I tell them, yeah. say, yo, how it go? I <laughs> tell people for watch it, I go watch it back later. I just yeah. all my stay. I'm not too crazy if it about you know, myself. I video they that still, when I do work, you know? Mm. So the rhythm I go on being the man them bust pan it, man. I'm okay. I'm eating every day. I'm beating I go on and drinking rum and Red Bull. Cargo songs. Cargo. Creep up. Creep up, creep up, creep up till it does go so shh. No, sell out, my friend. Yeah. My song is juggling, because you know, I have the only girl song on it. You know. I just started to get some video from my Blackberry. The man yeah. said, DJ, watch her. Dog, your song playing a beer fight going on one night. Girl, I'm a fight now. I just started to get beer fight. So girl, I walk out. And next girl. And the song just become a, a song. Where selector does not say, yeah, man, mash up the dance, yeah, watch it. And I hit, start from England, come over. So till people from England say, call me, for birthday, do plate for them girl, they want me to sing a song, call. Right, they want out. she walk out, tweet, <laughs> and I have to customize it. <laughs> and I say, like, really, yeah. walk one. Yeah. So till, bro, the song just pick up, pick up, pick up. America, I see him vibe, be a wife, New York, girl, them start going, be a thing, and mash up dance. And, mm. and I say, what the hell is this? I just love it, start love it, work yeah, with start it. I love it. Man, I'm saying, yo, next rhythm. No. Dan link me. Yeah. I say, yeah. I say, yo, we have a song for you. Yeah, like rhythm. <laughs> yeah. They tell me, I'm done them. I be a rhythm, me, but I'm not the artist thing. I'm done them, I make a song to have a voice tonight, but people don't know. Because I'm not really. I'm uh, a voice in a couple. project that out there. Yeah, in a couple songs. When I smoke, I get so high. Seriously? Yeah, me, Dan, Baby G. Our Baby vibe. G. We never know. Our vibe is another. Yeah, man. Baby G, man. Yeah, man, when Dan I create you, you say, anything you miss, Dan will do it. Dan you see just like, you okay, don't know, cool creative man. and bad like that. So, he must say, yo, DJ, Liquid, come sing your song. You want the next voice? And we used to sing them things there. Because they, they met before Cartel mm. America. Okay. Them things they create before Dan say, yo, Umiagi. And I say, yo, something like that, ADR, you know? Yeah. So, them things there, me, me and him, we spend hours at the studio. Me and Dan always there at the studio. 
I have other issues. But, yo, I like. I win. I need a ring. That was a dub plate. I need a ring, man. That was a, that was a vendetta dub plate. See? Vendetta dub plate that. I win boss. And then I said to myself, Liquid, you know, say, long time I advise I win. I know him long time. I know him I go boss. You know? I have four songs with him. And then they had that. And I said, yo, he have a bad song. I know, say, yo, it's a hit song this man give him. No, hear it. And then go so boom and start look for the dot. The whole night, man, the DJ, man, the dino part. He stood there. I searched through that. <laughs> till we find it. <laughs> and we go so boom and down at the band ribbon, take off the dub and mix the dub. Because it only said Vendetta Girls. And it's bad. Yeah. That's the only thing up our intro. And bro, we turn it now a bad song, man. Wicked song. song Running the whole place so till I win. I have to come voice it over for the album, man. I have to come find it, man. You see, me have to find that, man. Yo, enough great things them out there, man. Enough great things. Them out there bust me in the music fully. Fully, meaning not all back, meaning all night, everything. If a rhythm I make me dead, if it's from scratch, every song where I mix, me and him dead. This, the watch why I do, learn. You feel me? So, I have to tell him, I have to tell him thanks, because he helped me and changed my life enough. He gave me my first hit rhythm, but I can change my life, upgrade my car, yeah. buy my little studio, teach me how to deal with recording, deal. Get liar for me, teach me how to get the right liar. The whole thing, bro. You see me? Between him, Cool Face, them, DJ Wayne, the whole team, they saw Frank White, Blacker Cartel, because that was the team. Mm. You feel me? So I can't leave them home. I love them endlessly, dog. Because them make could there and. I journey that teach them, we come and do these things, produce yeah. again to the final. You know, we do a good book, rhythms yeah, like that. When I reach us yet, man, oh. when I rush to you, yeah, right. ready for you though. Ready, your time. <laughs> the next hit song was Walk Away. Right, that was the follow up. Mm. Because Sean is, Sean is a, like again. Sean is a go with the momentum. Mm. After the hit of one, one day, day with split personality. Split. Mm -hmm. So I said, yo, I work with the same family line right away. Car go ready right away and go find, and find the song. Now say, love me, friend, I wonder if. Can't hold him. Gone! Man, I said, liquid, where are you there? I said, I'm ready, you know? Yeah. I said, why are you going to sing? I said, yo, I have things, man. That's select advisor, give them a Yeah, man, because I have things. I see things, I see them, I play everywhere, them time, I heart like fire, you know? My heart is DJ, them time, there, you know? Yeah. But then we reach a part there, you know? I just like, concentrate, part, meaning me, I do the DJ thing, yeah. I produce, produce, and I do the artist yeah, thing. One time, all of them. I go down there, and I said, man, I said, why are you going to sing a thing, there? Bossawa, and I say, Bossawa, I can't do it. Bossawa, I say, only not see it, you know, out there. Yeah. Everything I sing, I want to see her going out there, and I go to a country or something, you know. Yeah, I know why girl I'm a do that. I'm just sing that. Eh, eh, can you know, girl, like a Bossawa, I'm like your thing, I squeeze you. That time you want them make me need you, you have a. You know, we don't go to a ranch, but we just go right. So the girl them can do them thing. And that was that was the aim, too. If you don't really sing raw, but right. That's it, you know? On tour and shit. Yeah, man. Chant a song was the follow up song. Chant a song was TJ Records. TGA. You know, that song came about when we get suspended. I would have talk about that doggy road. Yeah, yeah, because I get suspended during that time. First time you get suspended? Second. Second time. Second time. Mm. Second time I get suspended. So second time I get suspended was in them time, but 2010. Yeah. So I'm telling you, when I get suspended, I have a wife who walk out oh, and I'm saying. So I did get suspended, busy the same way. Because mm. I have all of that are going for me. Where you get suspended again? Where, why? Why? Uh, Badwood. Play. Badwood. Yeah. yeah. First time, yeah. Because mm. them time we get CD when everything is good. Yeah, and, right. and everything you can fix, something's close. Mm. And you know the thing go. But yeah, I play my thing and I take my suspension. And the second time then, I get a CD label wrong. It's a clean, when I'm not clean. And them time when we play it, when we pick it up and play it, I mean, crew man. So I have a witness of definitely what said so the mistake oh, there, not even me. Yeah. A clean version I play and it. And I I listen. Because I remember, if you understand, I remember if you are a captain and ship, you are a captain and ship. Mm -hmm. You can't jump all of the people then for ship us in. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, last man, you have to take the blame for all that. I me a front man, I me a do the show. Yes. And I hold the road. And, I, and, I, and I, nobody don't want to hear about the mistake. I walk, I walk on. So I won up, 
because you don't know your man, you have to one up, so I one up my thing. Um, and that was like my longest suspension. And during that time, no matter what I go, I just show, I just show me, 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 me radio station and underneath the bus. Right. Nobody didn't see me a complain now, nobody didn't see me a, a tab or nothing. I just so hold, hold, hold my thing as a man. Yo, I get four months, and during that four months, I never go down a zip one time. Because even go look like. I just wait till the day when the boss say, liquid, it look like a free up, you know. And nobody never did know either. Not even who I relief me did know. I just come up on the radio and I trend the day up on Twitter. Like, <laughs> everybody did say my gun. Mm. Brother, I can't I sit down. I sit down and hear my friend say my gun, man. Yeah. I look up on the man and I say, yo, Zip sent me a suspension letter. Not an expulsion. I suspend, I get suspend until Zip say otherwise. I don't fire myself. I tell you, there are times where you, where you feel like Jano. It doesn't make no sense. Jano star. Four months now or three months now in a dark. But is it true? I have the other, other stuff that I right, go on for right, me. Right, right, right. I fly right. out a lot. Then time I'm well busy everywhere. You know, I'm a bus all in Miami and them places every week. And I have to, I have to refuse them times. So I'm busy. You know, during that time I go to Dubai me and Protoje. So the frustration never as much as it could yeah, have been yeah. if you never did it. Yeah, never because I did it busy at the and time. Jaworks, yeah. Jaworks and mm. things like fans them create a Facebook page, put ZJ Liquid back on here, and that get like 10,000 likes within a week. And yeah, the movement it was so powerful. Mm. I couldn't give up on myself. You know, the people them, my fans them, and my family, I say, I want to everything I got right, man, go and hold it. You know, my wife, I say, yo, my, Pray for you, I'm to you, you hold it. More than night time, she wake up and say, You wake up, come and pray. <laughs> no, real thing. <laughs> them things, the woman do, I have to talk. I don't know, joke yeah. and say, Yeah, I'm to you. You know, God does a give you a warning, you're all right, hold it. You go all right, I'm going and hold it. So till me get by the call. I mean, you know, I just go and step back, pull up back, same pace again, no ease up thing. I'm just going and work because. Where you go, nobody not there for blame for nothing. We don't do the time already and we know it go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, you know, I made that. And I had a big song in the catalog, uh, Wife Material. Wife Material, Wade Wife Marshall. Wade Marshall. Mm -hmm. Wade Marshall. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Marshall, them call me. Because during the time I did that Wife Wife out as a big right. song and I made Marshall find that. I say, yo, that body Marshall, I'm going to call him. I say, Marshall, send me that. And the washroom was, a, a, you know, you tell me know from a long time, from Tommy. Because I record Tommy from a second rhythm, me and Dan them. Mm. So before all of that, we, we, we know Tommy and we work with Tommy, we cool with Tommy like that, you see me? So that go on and we do the medley video. Go on with itself. And to, we are bubbling, you know. Hold it more, sir. Yeah. Yeah, we are come back to his songs, them, so a few things. Because during that time, wife walk out. I'm going to do first best of the best. You know? First best of the best? Yeah, so I'm going to perform my best of the best that year. Pamban. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no chance. Dude. Rough cut. Rough cut? Definitely. Yeah, the fans say you rough cut, the funny thing I go Yeah, on. you feel like I deal with? We spoke just, just now about the suspension. So yeah. you have only been suspended twice? Three times. Three times, so you were suspended again after that? Yeah. Same type of situation? Yeah, but that situation was another situation where me and it was kind of internal, so you know what I mean? We kind of mm -hmm. understand it. Yes. But. There was there was a little spot between you and Vice Cartel over the all business one at the time. What, the all thing? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, because people say what they feel for say. Yeah. Misinterpret the all. Man, I say, Amigi Cartel all. And I say, well, I want to get that from. Me know all oh, as a country youth. My grandmother oh. enough people used to say it. And me added them used to roll up and done them. So it's something we used to just say oh. from the whole link and how mm. we talk. So nobody not talk about who do it or who come up with it. I just apart from here we talk, so you know, a part of the link. You know what I mean? So when me hear all that and be a thing and so I send out some message and a, a this me and be a thing. So I said, Dan, what that? So I get to it now. I say, yo. Man, I said, them give me all oh, one. So I said, oh, I don't know where you get that from. Because I said that, you know. I just record the song around Mr. G and I said, oh, one time, two hours. I said, oh, because the whole will link. And the man, them take the oh, they copy it and put another song and it work. And 
He add to the song is a good vibe. A good vibe. You understand what I mean? I know how I make the song it. I mean lyrics them wife you walk out and and it was not a tech thing because at the time Cartel and DJ respect him. Remember every, everything with Cartel them time there, I we a boss. Me yeah. and DJ win. So it would never be a disrespect or but you don't know, people say this and people say that. And I saw things go more well. Mm. But you don't know, we work it out. Oh yeah, are you good now? Yeah. Mm. We are for good. Are for good. Just, you see me? Because music we deal with and I'm from day one. Remember I'm from next millennium, you know. And I'm from, I'm from 2002, you know. There was also a little thing with you and Roach before. Uh, Roach? Yeah, I see watch an interview where Roach said some, some things. Yeah, me and Roach kick off now. Cause Roach was one of we at the time. I remember some tell you and can't tell him. Right. And Roach so was the man. Right, I can't right, tell right, me right. meet Roach. Rest him soul, a good youth. Mm. You understand? You don't know thing go. Me and Roach kick off over this. Me not do a Roach one of them. Which is play one song when gear. Right. So he might add it to kick off. You know when they break up. So Roach do a song at this cartel. I mean, I say, Roach, you're mad. You can't play. It's two hours on my bridge, man. I'm in a business where I don't want to have, man. I can't go play in a song of this idea and two hours on my bridge. I mean, no, it's two hours on my bridge. I can't get involved in that. I don't do that. Same as, I'm a valid rhythm at the time, and I play rhythm. But I don't play the song the way I'm at this idea. And that Roach upset both, so. But that woman, Roach come and zip, I don't know if I interview her when I come, and I come, I go and zip, and cuss off the people them, because I carry that with him. Because I mean, nah, he man had the friction of going. Um, you don't know, we now work with what I want for them. So they call me and I say, Liquid, you want to watch some friend? I'm just come down and this way and tell about my mother and dating. And so I say, Roach, I can't watch Roach. I'm Roach over you. I'm Roach good like that, you mad. So I call him as a virgin. And I say, Roach, how are you going? How are you trouble? How are you going? I say, Craziness. I say, yo, all you two in a liquid, I want to yo. The mother, so I say, Roach, I tell him about mother, what, what could I go on? Yo, now nah, play my thing on way, 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 way. And we just stay out of my way. And I'm stay out of my way till we did it, did it, did it, did it for years. Till him have a rhythm. When him, overproof. Overproof. Yeah. And the music I did, I hear me hear and like it. Big rhythm, man. I said, the rhythm my body, man. And I'm going to with it. I'm going to take it rhythm and beat it till I see my ear. I say, yo, I'm liquid not good. I'm liquid not good. I am liquid i play my rhythm like a film. I'm going to say, Roach, the music I deal with, all the while of that I deal with. He accused you in a couple of interviews of selling spots on the radio. Selling spots? Mm -hmm. I don't sell spots. I zip sell spots. Zip sell spots. I play music. You play music? Yeah. Because man, I'm going to say anything when you don't do what them for do. He can't accuse me of something I'm never, me and him never do it. Them asked him the question and he said no. So, and all of that out of anger, as I tell you. Yeah. Because man, I mean, no, and all of it used to roll. But, I mean, no, nah, God, you can't press my button, dog. So, was there any resolution between you and Roach before? Yeah, so now that I tell you, me and him, I get overproof and I like it, and we link up back and I say, yo, DJ Jano. Know the thing that it go on, I miss everything, whatever. And we just, yeah, we, we, we fix it, we fix after that. Mm. We fix after that, we fix after that, no doubt. You see me? We're glad to hear that. Yeah, man, we fix, we I fix know after that. I some things have been said since, but we're not getting involved in that still. Yeah, but we're glad to hear from you. Yeah, man, we're good, man. We did good after that. Because I remember said about three, four more rhythm after that, the G did have. And we are, we are man, him good. Because they like the new, the new project and the new link, and the link with. What man you the name man a link? Justice. Just when the man made the light the vibration. That's why I say I'll overproof. Me they love the rhythm and love the project. Yeah man. A big rhythm man. Another bone of contention and controversy surrounding the liquid car. Yeah man, is always. The situation with milk. With that? Yeah. Them things are just part of life. Just part of and life. And nothing negative about that. No malicious. Nothing. No the about that. We were together at the time. Phone last. You know what I mean? We do a thing. Was last in yeah, we, four. yeah, we were a couple. Right. And the video was released. Yeah, and we, are an, and we are an en we are an enemy. So you guys are on speaking terms? No, uh, yeah, because it, it never something like what we do. Remember, you know, the phone last, some people find it and I say them want to reward. What do you call it? 
Oh, yeah. So, so, so there were yeah. attempts at blackmail. Yeah, so it were it were a blackmail sentence. And, we okay. did, and I say, yeah, <laughs> our money reaching and area, and by the time we look, we see them say rope rope. But that is that, and unfortunate. You don't know the thing, go. Did that affect you anyway? Because of course, she lost her job, but it must affect me, man. You still was Bro, working. Liquid. It must affect me, but I don't know my thing. It kind of set up different. Mm. I have a different type of job. Yes. A different vice, but it affects both of us. It affects me in a way where people feel like I may do it for purpose and I would never do that. I would never do that to the person I am with at the time. I would never have no problem. I would have to look into that, people. It was just unfortunate, say. It was where we were in the public eye and it worked out the way there. You understand? But yeah, man, we got through it and it affects me because enough people think. Yeah, people I think I went me and you have enough women that say, yo, I don't like him, co. you feel me, bro? But as, in, as time goes by and you get to tell the story, you understand, sir, it wasn't from them, <laughs> them, them, them part there, right. this thing I come from. Nobody never had no beef, nobody never had to try and mash up nobody. It was just so unfortunate. Very. Yeah, very. I'm glad for you, sir. Yeah. You but we have, but we have life. Yeah. Hmm? But so I'm glad for no say, you know, no kind of result something. Yeah, because you definitely so. want, you don't want to run away. Still, you want to say at least you want to stand up and and, and take your blame and take your your part. Right? So we not run. I'm not going to run away still. Mm. Can't run away from that. I feel it, brother. Hold it, cussing all all our people. I say until we can tell the, the right story. And it still, it still exists? People still kind of have you off because of that or that kind of thing? Well, maybe it. people do, I mean, I don't know, because I can't tell. And sometimes people have you off and you don't know either. That, that's <laughs> so, true, brother. That's so life stay, so I'm not going to say that. But you don't true. know. I hope them understand. I can't tell them, don't have me off. I hope them can see where it comes from and how it goes down. And, you see me? I have a different outlook and understand. Yes. You know? As a man who is responsible for the introduction of many artists to the business, yeah? Yeah. There has been a discussion, a public discussion down there that music influences crime, so to speak. We see recently the Prime Minister came out and said some things. Yeah. What are your views as it relates to that influence there with music or if there is any? <laughs> He said the music influenced crime, but he never said the music influenced politics to when he did I use it. Mm. Music have an influence overall. Music have an influence overall. Yeah. Mm. You understand? Yes. In, a, in, a, in a matter whether it influences crime, music, you don't know, music speaks to the soul and it's influential and depends upon who I do it and what you say. But at the end of the day, you have to know yourself as a person. You make a man in a song tell you what to do? Yeah, Are you know right from wrong? Are you definitely want to decide that? Because at the end of the day, you know, them show with everything. Right now, the fire blaze over there, so. And you're the writer, so you're comfortable. You're going to walk and go burn up yourself in a fire when you know so you're going to get burned up still. You still know, you know. Everybody have that intellectual capability that's fit, 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 fit. Shut off the music from the real life. Right, but that but right they say you can't cause that is just how life goes, so you can't right, put, so you can't, you can't put the, the blame music. on music okay. for how, how, how people stay. But you do admit that the music has the potential yeah, to man. influence yeah. the thought process of, of people. Of course. Of course. But at the end of the day, it's not gonna influence a nation. Yeah. Because <laughs> you listen to the music and you know influence Every day, music man. influence about a video you had, a video, yeah, a video thing, video a video TV direction of there, right? Yes. Exactly. <laughs> so, so so look how much man listen to the wicked scar tell them and, and when they don't see him come out to a bank. Yeah, come listen, from him bank yes, work. True. He just motivate him to do what he's interested in. Yes. At the end of the day, if you want to deal with gun, you have to deal with gun. And yeah, some youth are grew up in the best home, get the best parenting. True, true. And still true, turn out to be bad man and wicked. So everybody, before we blame the music, we have to blame yourself. We have to blame all away. Because all away play a part. And I have a role to play from parenting and from little brother to big brother to true sister that. to auntie. Fear yeah. enough, brother. Yeah man. Fear enough. So no say go. I say go, you know. I remember when Broga did one of the music influence him people, they made music. 
But when the music has influenced something what him now with, and but that I guess is, he that still have to talk to you. But that's what I'm trying to show him, you. Him, him have to talk. Right. But we have a problem with him talking. Mm. Well, but you don't. But don't people. make it seem like it's the music alone. No, it can't be the music ah, alone. Because poverty are the, uh, the, uh, many poverty are the main influence. Many factors. Because when a man hungry, not think about music. <laughs> yeah. When hungry, I twist up a tribe, you know why you're not song. Mm. You want food. So. When you reach to the so yeah. is the condition and the situation and the life yes. that you are living. Liquid has been probably the go-to radio this jack for years. Yeah. Along with Whistle and a few other people. I do this thing and every day man send me song and <laughs> I'm in a place I get a brother. Yeah. Every day man send me song for list or for the review and there's something. Oh your body try lad. Uh me, 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 me. I accept it. You accept it. I accept some of come with it. Mm. Like, you go out for it, and by the time the second time the waiter come back in my artist, <laughs> when he realizes that you. But at the end of the day, I know who me is, and I know I put myself out there as a youth where push young talent. Mm. So young talent will gravitate to me. Worse if he's a person where they feel like they can talk to. And worse if a person who make themselves self accessible. When I don't want to eat people, I just don't answer my phone and I take for myself. Mm. Apart yeah, it, must, it, must get, yeah. it must get too it, much sometimes. Yeah, it get too much sometimes, but as I tell you, I, I saw me deal with it when it's too much. I right. take for myself because I don't know who I is. And I know say, right, from going to the space and man see me, or a certain man see me, and I say, DJ, you know, see me have a song. Or... And I can't show from that because I may find the next biggest artist. Which is true. Which is true. You understand what yeah. I did? Yeah. No man ever checked me yet and say you you know play my song. No song sir, no that. man ever checked me. The only man who do something like that, cause I always get you to run. Or if, or if me not play, you me tell you why. Straight up. Yeah, most of dog it weak. You may not like it, but me not tell you say it weak. But you know when you find a strong song. Cause you go okay, I forward back. I'm a foot. <laughs> no, but I'm for real to the music and I'm in a sense yeah. I play and can't and he can't he not do nothing for you. Yeah. You're not a boss, you're not get a boss. People not hear you and say, John, I'm like, you're you, you, you improver. You're you, 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 you yeah. a played for. You ever turn your song from a youth and that song they hit somewhere else? I don't think, I'm not, no, because I never turn your song, you know. You don't play it. So you would collect it, but you don't play it. Maybe I don't play it right away. Oh, okay. But I don't turn it away. Because maybe, some, I want to tell you, so sometimes, Sometimes music it's uh, different from different angles. Mm. Sometimes you may, you may get a song, but oh, you, you just play it regular. You don't get the vibe there. Sometimes you may drive from the radio and hear it play. Different with the with next song, from a different pace, different momentum. And you're like, yeah, but now the song that I get it, it have a vibe, eh? Yeah, man. It's them come enough ways, brother. Yeah. Sometimes I just I listen to the next radio station and hear a song and say, blow, the song the bad. How which artist is that? Yeah, I just start poor white because I just like it. And I, I saw the artist them find me more and said, Dog, I play my song, but I just, you know what I mean? I'm new, if I love a song, I have the art show in and I want my art show. Art songs. Art songs. Not, not, <laughs> not side thing or, or art songs. Art songs. That boy alone, too. Mm. You feel me? Yes. There's somebody. This jacket still have the. Because, you know. Morph man, you have them you them vivo and them this and that. Yeah. This jacket still have that, that power that to make or break an artist's career I, again. Of course, because you have to believe so you have the power and make them know you have it. <laughs> you still have it. Is that thing, you know? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. People can feel the energy there. Mm. You know what I mean? I yes. know I have it. Because I know no song now for play. I can just come pick a song and me alone can't sit. Can, can stay upon it. And tell I'm the people. A, I'm a, I'm a, I can guarantee you. Never accept it from the ear, them others start gravity. Or, or a selector goes, yo, the song you bought. Because it's not, it's not even about me. Yeah. I sang, you just want ears. And a way you bring it across, because sometimes you have to listen to a song. Yes. If you know you serve it to people. How many artists in the business you then take credit for bossing them? Uh, I don't want to take credit for busting no artists. Mm. Like, mother, 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 mother more say, yo, take credit for start the wave. 
start the way, right? But give me some people you start. You know the I mean, because me, me alone can't do it. Right. But, right. but me can start it. And I mean, I appreciate people, that. You understand what I did? That's how me look on it. I appreciate it. Because anytime I do it, the other DJ we do say, it, yo, yeah. or hear it, or like the song you're doing it. And that start the way. So I'm me alone. But, artists, when I come what, what forward, I'm a foot first, I'm really. Enough. No. Like mainstream right now? Mainstream. Mm. Alright. We play Papi first. Bless yeah. him up. Play Movada first. Uh, like, people did afraid of alcohol when they do the black eye thing. You play him first. And him come check me and I see the eye. And, but you know, that never matter to me because I don't know Mr. Youth or, or been around and know so you can't have in contact with him. I never know how him do it. I never ask him. I just see it and say, yo. I saw him look black eye. I take a picture with him and say, yo, the black eye youth. It's a before him do all the live show up. Uh. See? And him play. He did play enough song for me. Because then time I go to Youth Tech. I used to play a Youth Tech. Mm. And I hear the song name. Come over, baby. Yeah. I listen enough of the song them. And if I hear the song the out of the lot, I say, yo, that are the hit song. You might go bust off of this and the song that did bust. And I move from there, so. Bugle, Serrani, Ladden. Boy, I them can't remember. Quite a number of people. Yeah, you know what I mean? A lot of people. Was. Was. You know, one of my, you know, my artists that mm. great thing. Munga. Munga. Angel. I can't remember when Delirang sent me Downtown Girl. I'm just a Downtown? Downtown. Yeah, Danny Champagne. Mm. See me? Yeah. <laughs> ah. You don't have to tell me who of them. Boy, still. I will leave, you know, some of them can't yeah, remember until right. them just forward in a in a Genius. Genius. Chi, Chino. Um, we're very instrumental in our breaking crane in a Jamaica market. You look like them are called them. Mm. You see me? Yeah. Mm. Yeah, <laughs> we're, enough. We're yeah, man, you know the thing, uh, enough. Speaking about DeMarco, what are the, what are the rhythms that you, where you produce? DeMarco have a monster hit band, Good Book. Yeah, that was that, like, that was like my first DeMarco track. My that was the first DeMarco first track. First time. Mm. Good Book, rhythm of a history. I uh, had that rhythm like from a first set of rhythms, like from Crazy, French uh, Vanilla and, and Hello Moto. Jam 2 made that rhythm for me. From that, from those times, I'm of it. That rhythm used to name Bill Buck. That's the Bill first Buck. name I did get. But when TGA linked me, TGA Records, same old star produce, with that rhythm that him called Bill Buck, the name of me did have Bill Buck for my rhythm. I said, yo, come, I always name the rhythm name before. Oh, okay. So I always have some, some name, some name thing. And they were like, yo, look, we can't, bigger than we can't use the name there. I said, TGA, yeah, man, I can't use the name. So TGA first rhythm was, well, yeah, Bill, Bill Buck. Buck was originally good book name and it was originally good book but I have the rhythm but the pace was ne every time I say I do a rhythm I know it mm. because you, you can't feel it and I can remember the November 20, 2013 into 2014 but I say yeah I'm going drop a juggling man I say DJ nothing new what going where where and I say I watch the place man because the place is fast and beating and I have a good book and I fly it I take it out and just a plate in my studio up in my yard. Just a plate. Some do it with him like a half hour, one hour. Mm. And he just a play. And I did have a cartel, whole cartel where we did jump to the fly pan it. I did have. And I said, bad man, you come on, you come on, fly it, do it, do it, do it, do it. And I always just listen to it. And I say, right, I'm going to drop, you know, I feel like I'm going to drop the rhythm. The place I do everything else, but I just say, I'm going to drop the rhythm. And I said, I'm going to get Delhi. And Delhi record a song named Silly Billy. I'm going to have it. Silly Billy, and you look. I'm going to reach out to DeMarco. I'm going to say, DeMarco, I have a project, you know. I feel like I'm here. I'm going to say, send it. I'm going to send it to him. I'm telling him they are fine, same man. And I'm saying back the song. Hey, yo! Take a good look. I'm going to say to him, I'm going to message him back. I'm going to say, dog, you hate. <laughs> and the man say, yo, 
Liquid, stop from with me. I said, dog, you eat. I said, I'm going to name a really my good book to you eat. Mm. So, so I name so a really. So and then I send it to Movado. And then Movado, they are foreign and the man is cussing about him, I fall a rapper and everything. But I'm going to always a link. You see me? Always a link. And I said, DJ, what are going on? I said, everything good, man. You know, it's man in my beat or whatever. But I said, yo, I have a new project in G. Call me G that. We don't watch them talk. I mm. send it to him. And him record, show me a the man. And he just sing about what I go on. Mm. And from here, man, sing about what I go on. I said, go here, it. <laughs> see? I <laughs> have four songs. I send it to conscience and then do a song for the name Code. And by November, I have four songs. I'm going to play the four song till January. Me alone. I'm not give nobody my rhythm. I'm going to play the four song from November to January. And the rhythm bus from December. And I still not give it out. I start, at that time, I start record for it. Till I say, all right, I'm run out the four song now. I'm going to whistle them and chrome them. And Kick away. The mark will take it still. Yeah, good book. <laughs> good book? Yeah. Mm. Let me do fix up after that. Yes. Well, you, well after all the rhythms, because I only for rhythms you, 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 you produce, yeah? Yeah. Which rhythm are your favorite where you produce? But I enjoy producing yeah. and love. Boy, I love all of them, you know. But I don't know, good book could give me a vibes. Mm. There's yeah, something about good book when good book starts to take over the world, like, but the rhythm drop the brother. It's yeah. Is a different good zone book. here now. Good book and I think name. Bluetooth. Bluetooth. Say she want me. Squeeze her. I don't know the rhythm. <laughs> yeah, the rhythm they because I see at the time. It was the rhythm that was so off, mm. people think it wouldn't work. When we pick it, then I say. Look at the rhythm, man. Yeah? I'm gonna say, yeah, dog, it's different. Bad. And I said, boy, I don't know why you here. I must say, Dan. <laughs> I said, Dan. Can I make more well than my rhythm? I said, yo, DJ, I hear rhythm this make last night. And I said, I'm here. I said, because so we work, you know, if we don't like it, we talk, we do one another. Yeah. I said, yeah, it's bad. Okay, different dog. I said, yeah, man, I like how you're different. I said, how you do it? I said, watch out. And I saw we do it, man. Mm. Why, well, favorite rhythm when you make? My favorite rhythm? Yeah. The rhythm they have in here juggle on a good day. My favorite rhythm, I don't know that. You see French vanilla? French vanilla. But no favorite rhythm that man? Yeah, but I don't know me. I don't make that. I don't make it. Oh, okay. And and Well, I love fix up. Fix up. Fix up give me a crazy energy. Fix up just build me build my vibes. Yeah. I can just listen to it all the while. Just mm. the rhythm alone. And it can, can DJ anything, pan, any song can go on, it's just a rhythm way. Three rhythm me after, I love the cranium rhythm. Can't believe. Can't believe. Yeah, that's one of my final bigot. Yeah. Yeah. You have voice, many artists, yeah? Yeah. You play many artists, you listen to a million songs. You have a favorite DJ? <laughs> You know, the DJ, my favorite DJ go with my mood. Oh, okay. Yeah. If you understand how oh, my DJ is. My mood is in and out, what's your favorite DJ? Like, like my mood I'm in and out, yeah. it would have been more than one. Because mm -hmm. enough look of vibes what I like. Yeah. I like Skilly. You like Skilly? Yeah, because I have the unorthodox, mm -hmm. unpredictable thing about him. He reminds me of the cartel vibes. He's a man, you don't know what I say. I like an artist who keeps on the edge. No predictable. Yeah. Till, you, know, you don't know him young enough, so I'm going to find him one. Right. So I don't right. go up and I don't criticize him, I just tell him what I like. Right. Massacre. Because I'm a massacre, he's a youth, just mad word play. Every I'm, time, man. And I rate him from a long time. Every from Rupa Dan, I rate Massacre. Mm. Massacre can tell you that. I show him love and support. Bad DJ. You feel me? You don't know world boss. Mm. You understand me, I did. And I don't tell her that I did music on a level. I have time to hear my sizzler. I have time to hear my black woman and chime. I have time to hear my good ways. <laughs> yeah. I just saw me did music. Yeah. I have time to hear my other killer. 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 I have
the thing them. In the kitchen running now. You understand? Food. Yes, sir. Yeah. Mm. I mean, I'm telling you, I listen to Papi. So it depends on your mood. Alkaline. And you, have, you, have, you know, I'm telling you, I want to hear. You know, the woman, them who give me some vibes too. I like my coffee when I'm ready. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I like Leela. Yeah, yeah. Cecile. Mm. Yo, enough girl give me the vibes, brothers. Shensia. Because she has the little bad girl thing about her. But it's classy. Kind of bougie, see yeah, it's yeah, classy. You know, yeah. bougie, you know? Yeah, man. <laughs> yeah, man. Jada, the whole of them. Believe me, bro. All I music, when you see me play, they give me that energy. Mm. Me and my dear, they do everybody does a playlist. I saw me listen. You have gone some places where some man not go here. BT 106 and Park. Yeah. BT Cypher. Yeah, first one ever. First one ever. Yeah. Yeah. Big achievement, them, the brother. Yeah, you know what I mean? Definitely, I'm grateful. So, I get the opportunity. The BT Cypher, right there, so. I have a big up Ramesh, same way. Because mm. I don't know. I have the team, and you know, I'm linking up. And I say, yo, DJ, they want a DJ, and you may send. So, I have to say, Ramesh, big up for the opportunity. Nice one. Opportunity there. Eh? Like 106, 106 and Park, I like, I just, me playing out over the world and meeting DJs and just making that connection. Uh, DJ Charlie B, him oh. DJ for Drake and Future them. Canada Bass, Charlie B. Yeah, Canada mm. Bass. Meet him, go play him party and him event and we just have a relationship and a vibe. And he opened that door there. And he opened that door there. I see him on it and chew a link. And I said, Dog, you're the pan 106, so you rich. I'm saying, yo, the virgin. He did on my yard. <laughs> and I say, you're a liar, tell. <laughs> and I say, liquid, I'm a friend. You don't believe me? Watch, I get you on. Mad. And honestly, less than three. Charlie yeah. B. He make it up, man. I get on, but you don't know. When you get on for them things, you have to keep yourself on. Meaning, you don't know. You have to reach early. Your attitude, you have to, your attitude have to right. You have to be professional. And that is what they liked about me the first time. That's why they invited me back the second time. Mad thing. Yeah. In 2017, Red Bull Culture Clash yeah. and Rolly Cam, you were a part of the team. Yeah, we win that. We win that. Champion. Good achievement that again, brother. Yeah, that's that one of the achievements for me. You know, I'm grateful for that because out of the country, I'm going to really make a mark out of the country with dancer. I come back home being in, you know, people with that pressure, we say, boy, popping or dead, and people think, when it we wasn't when we wasn't gonna get that support, but they don't know the team did strong, catalog did strong, and we did represent a big team, and we just do a thing and come home with the trophy. Mm, speaking about achievement, you see, what would you say is Liquid's single greatest musical achievement so far along the journey? Along one of my greatest achievements so far is getting a chance to go like Europe and. Closing the biggest festival two years back to back that has never been done. Which festival? Ratatam. Ratatam. And you close it yeah. back to back. Yeah. They never repeat back to back yet. But at the first, they make an exception. Mm. And you know, feel special for that definitely. So now, big up all of them make that possible. But I mean, make it possible because if I never did that work and do the work too, it couldn't happen. Because yes. if you put me on the stage, I'm going to perform your flap. Is there anything from a musical level where you can achieve it or you still want to achieve? Yeah. Mm. I still want to build both there for myself, Liquid. You mean as an artist, as, as a, a producer? Yeah, as an artist. As an artist. And as a producer. Yeah, I me, 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 me have billboard song or enter the billboard, but I know me personally. Right. But I still work for me. You know what I mean? And you have to look, uh, next project I work on I'm a book. Book? Yeah, because enough things left out of this one, you know, my book it off ago. <laughs> yeah, interview there too long, brother. Yeah, you know what I mean? Enough things, believe yeah. me, yeah, you know, enough so things. So the book start right already? Yeah, the book start already. Yeah? The yeah. one we can look for. It's uh, a good book. Was, was <laughs> aiming... Was, was aiming for my birthday, because I always like the big things for my birthday. Mm. If you know, I'm a party, I release my album. You know, things like that. I always like the big things for me. Yeah. Like, gift myself with stuff, so... Hopefully, uh, we can get to write the story and make everything run. Yeah, speaking about the album, the last one you released was what? My Point of View? Point of View. Point of View. October last year. Which was before that? Uh, before that was Mobius Sun. And before, Mobius Sun. Mm -hmm. And before that was M Square, which was M -square. like a Khalid type of album. Because I kind of adventure in that various artist mm -hmm. thing a long time. 
Me I do some serious body of work, boy, place, brother. I just single, 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 single. No, I no, no, try. I try my best to just get me on in every little thing yes. right now, musically. And you know, I have the liquid, liquid wear line. Yeah. You know, me ease off of that for a minute because it takes a lot of it takes a lot of, lot, of, lot of attention and time. Mm. And, you know, need some more creative people. Speaking, need to build a bigger team. Yeah, speaking about and you know, everything. This jacket, artist, producer. You never feel like you do too much sometimes. No nah, man, remember my father too. <laughs> yeah. No nah, man. You can't do too much if you can't do it. You can't do too anytime much. You, you anytime do you do too much when you can't do it, man. <laughs> People say, same can't manage. That, that beef, that you do too much when you can't Exactly, because I have my own analogy to, my, to, to how I do my thing, you know. Right. I, me, me learn from other people, I take what I want, mm. but, but me and them. You know what I can't manage. You just say your father, how many youths? Three, two Three. girls, one boy. Yeah? Nice, yeah. man. Yeah, man, everything. See, you don't have <laughs> big old ring for your finger. Yeah, man, big up my wife. How long? A while. A while. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. A while. Yeah. All the life there, because some of the man them share with friends that's up there though. It's alright. It's alright. Yeah, but <laughs> no, for real, believe me, I mean, I got, that's something I did not live before that. Yeah. Because the person I'm with, I've been with the person. Listen, okay, you know, okay. just living and having the kids and so I never have to change up what me I do. All the youths are with the wifey? No, two of my youths with wifey. Okay. Like, you know? I know. No. One of my next youth, but yeah. you know that go. Everything alright. <laughs> Everybody are one family. One family. Yeah, one. That's what I said. Yeah, you man. have collaboration with Noah Power. They don't like me. That yeah. song did very well. Very. Yeah, collaboration with people like Conscience, Aishana, with the Man Marcos. Without, Band the Marco, with Safari. Beanie Man, Secret. Bean, yeah. Wally Patron. Egyptian. Wally Patron. I have collab with Egyptian, they come. Collab yeah. them. High Water. Enough people. High Water. Yeah, I have enough work coming. Mm. Is there anybody we ain't work with yet on a collaborative level? As an artist, yeah. that you don't mind going to the studio with Gabay as a song? Yeah, man. I don't work with Movie yet, I don't work with Killer yet, I work with Beanie already. It's a secret. Yeah, I don't work with Papi yet. Mm. Enough artists I want to work with, man. I read the whole part of my mother like work with, man. Yeah. You yeah, do music from them time till now, Liquid. Yeah. Whichever way, playing them or something. Yeah. Is there anything outside of music where you think you love enough where you have never music and then you even put food on your table? Yeah, because I remember saying, you know, I'm telling you before, I'm good at TD, technical drawing, engineering. Architecture. Yeah, so I'm good at, I'm good at, I would be doing engineering, drawing, and architectural because I'm very good at that. I mean, you know, it's something I love. Mm. So if, if the music never did kick off like what it did at a very young age, maybe I would have go there and I did have aspiration to be a pilot. Yeah? Yeah. Mm. Yeah, man. Yeah, fly said we, man. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now, the recent songs are kind of get a local buzz. Are the song with you and your bridging from them time? Bada General. Oh, Bada General, yeah. Mm. The Barrel. Barrel. That's the same Froggy Mat Squad. Froggy Mat That I do very well, you know. And you know, Froggy take on the DJ thing and I do very well. But I just see it's just transition over, mm. over the period of time of just in the music. If you not learn and transit, then why? You got stagnant. Yes. Anybody ever tell us uh, you give them a low key type of vibes? All the way. From day one, people always say, Yeah? Yeah, feel a low key. I would mean, laugh, brother, <laughs> yeah. like a low key. Yeah, <laughs> like man. Like a low key, be a low key. Yeah, man, a big singer, man. I'm a singer, big up, lost. Mm. For the youths I'm out there who have aspirations to venture in the, this jacket, music, production thing, any, any words of encouragement and advice? Uh, uh, be patient. <laughs> like for real, because sometimes you go rush it in already. Mm. And it, are the type of thing where when you're not ready, it can't show. Because if you put up on a stage where you're not ready for, you're a flap. Yes. We go sister, you're not ready. But all of those things help make you still. Every man have to catch a flap and get to bow and get to all of that. Okay. You feel me? So, you help build you. But that means be patient and believe in your thing. And you have to understand, say, every, every plant bears a different season. I remember that say, every, every, every fruit or whatever, they bear upon a different time. So everybody, know, everybody don't reap the reward at the same time. So not because you don't reap now, that means your reward not there. You have to just be patient, and I say, patient, I'm going to make your faith and go and hold it. And work hard, brother. Work, work hard. hard. Work 
if you, if you feel like if you work harder than everybody else, work hard because you'll get the pay there. Some of you, work hard. Bad day, good day, work hard. Yeah. Why are you more successful than financially? Ah, uh, why if you walk out and smile upon face? Smile upon face. What's your favorite song that you sing? That song that you go back to most and, and meds it and... I always I sing it. Yes. <laughs> I know that I had enough songs I sing I like, you know, but I always I sing Walk on Wine. Walk on Wine, for the girl there. Eh? Yeah, I always I sing the song yeah. because a, it's just a smooth song, it's an easy song to sing and I just like the song there because the song there was like just a, like a talk before it become a song. So it's something I just, I just always I sing. Yeah. Even if I'm on the mic and I vibe the party. Yo, it, For the girl, I yo, sing that same way. Mm. If I sing a song, I want to make a quicker song, I sing because I'm in a right, in a clean, it, you know, it's well familiar. You know? What's well, your favorite place to perform? What a DJ or play? No, wow. Youth. <laughs> Enough place that, you know? Yeah. For play? Yeah. Yo, I love play Canada. Mm. I love play Europe. Boy, have a thing named Mandeville and Watch it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, man. Them the, yeah, man. Them places they love always. Yeah, like, you know, even, even more than how Moby would have booked me. Mandeville and Watch it. She mm. always. Where you go, go work yet? Where? You hope you go to go work one of them times. Japan. Japan. Yeah. Japan, and you know, I've been in, people invite me to Australia. But I like to see that. You know? But, yeah. And you know, we have Caribbean countries that I'm not going yet still. Mm -hmm. But I'm not going to Trinidad go work yet. Yeah? Yeah, I never work at Trinidad yet. How come? I don't know. I just work around the whole <laughs> era. The time is so far away. Yeah. yeah. Recently, before the whole COVID situation. Yeah, I'm going to get Trinidad did one because uh, Smile Pan Face, the song with me, I know I did really big. Mm. And like, like the first song I really make Trinidad ask me. But well, I said Trinidad is a different market. Trinidad now. Them like tough things. Yeah. You know, I love the badness. The rough, rough song. Them. Before I wrap up, the last one I want to say, in doing the research for the interview, I realized that there's a prolific record, brother, a million songs you record, my lad. Like, as a, as a selector, you don't know song kill songs, sir? Yeah, but I don't do it the way there. Because I don't look upon it the way there. Oh, yeah, look upon it. I look upon my legacy. A legacy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So when the creative energy comes, you just yeah. lay it down. I mean, I'm going to look on the record as a selector. I'm going to be the biggest selector. Yeah. The most song. <laughs> as a selector, what trends in? I understand yeah. exactly what you're saying. Oh, remember what I ever asked you know, when I last <laughs> said, you're going to ask you. As a, somebody who coming into the business as a disc jacket and transition to mainstream as an artist, you know, have difficulty sometimes with people taking you seriously as an artist. That has been the journey. Yeah? Yeah. Because people just have some people just have said, oh yeah, this jacket is over yeah. there. But I learned what really what really changed that is hit songs. You can't grow that brother. And you can't tell people say yo me had this or me had that. You have to just show them. Yeah. You have, you have battled that. Yeah, I battled that, but I learned say. Still? Yeah. But no it no it no it's different now because I'm, I'm consistent. I realize say, yo, and a one half. Mm. And I buck up and I find them. Like, you know, them really, I'm really serious and really put my time to find hit songs. Not yeah. just because I sing songs and my name Liquid for use the advantage. Yeah. Yes. I find songs, I sing about things that other artists now sing about to try to be different. I never hear a barrel song. Yeah, exactly, that's yeah. so what I have to just show you. I have to do different. I can't go sing about Chap, sound like Mother Fala and just do the same thing. I can't yeah. sing about Bad Mind. That's easy to sing about. This Jackie, DJ, producer, what you prefer? There's no preference. A liar, I tell you. Because the whole of them are mood. Yeah. But I, I always love play music. Love it play always music. come first. Like play for Figures people. Mode yeah. still. I always love play music. That's what you tell me for a long time, Bridget. Yeah, but you know what I mean? Sometimes when I just want in a studio, yeah. just want to create it. Just yeah. in my head. That's what I say. I just say, like, mm. all my years, I just make songs or produce. Yeah. Uh, so. Brother, brother, big up yourself. Yeah, man. Yeah, the man who make. Really, this jacket thing, trendy. 
Yeah, yeah. I understand. Mm-hmm. Give, give it like a flair. Flair. <laughs> yeah. yeah, whistle. Yeah, we put, back, we put back the link there for real. Yeah, man, a brother link. Yeah, and a it, brother link. You know, it, it's strong. You get a flair there, both sides, I felt. Yeah, because it was the first combination, so. Mm. Our style. And a, and a theme style and enough for me. A phone style. Yeah, we were, we were together, so I me, me take from him, I take from me. And so you hear that. You hear some of Wizard, you, go, you hear some of Liquid when Wizard. So true. And you know, we just keep it honest and keep it real. Because I'm aware that him influence me. Mm. And I know I'm influencing. Brother, brother. The man uh, well, I'm not going to have the rest of DJ them too. Yeah. Cause you have DJ who respect mm. what influence me. Colin, Kurt. Dana Van Dekas, GT Taylor, oh, no man, GT Taylor, Winston yeah. Williams, Richie B. Mm. And you have a thing named DJ Clue. Clue. Because in the early 90s, I'm a family, then we bring a DJ Clue cassette from New York and I expose me to the. Yeah, Clue! The, the, the chant in Panama. Yeah. The style. But so. I can't finish that. Yeah. So, you know what I mean? Big up them people there. Yeah, man. And what me want to say now is that many people probably don't really see it yet. But looking at it, I realize that the man's contribution to the music is far and wide. And I just go around and can't go play some songs. They're responsible for the introduction of many rhythms, many artists. Yeah. You understand? They bring a certain level of creativity and flair to the thing. And we were loving music from them time till now. We appreciate that, brother, brother. Yeah. You understand what I mean? Say? Yeah, man. And the man, the man still have a lot to offer to his thing, bro. You know what I mean? Man, look young, are we? As long as the journey, as <laughs> long as we're there, we'll continue to do the work, bro. Yeah, man. Brother, brother, dig yeah. up yourself and go on with the thing. And a family thing. Anytime, you know. Just Anytime. Teach them. Yeah, man. Teach them. Yeah, yeah. You know what I think, Yo, bro. respect. For mm. me, I could get a chance to tell some of my story. Some of my story. Think up a tune for your girl, you know. Well, you know, then, them know the thing, them, man. Why if you walk out and me to stand up? Oh, bust a walk, bust a wine. Bust a walk and then you bust a wine. Eh, eh. Every girl, bubble. Bubble, bubble. Every girl for your ticket and now. Wife material, some, some girl a clout. Now listen some of them when, when them attack. attack. You know the thing go. <laughs> World where we live in now, it's crazy. Now if you do them nothing for them yet, to, eh? we just a go and live a life. Teach them live your life. We keep a smile for our face. Just for... And you know the thing go. <laughs> yeah. Right Teach Man. them. Blessed, respect, liquid. My dear. Teach them! Hey yo, hello! Send the message and make it reach them. It's teach them right here. Warlord representing. Thank you for watching. Like the video before you go. Please subscribe if you haven't done so. And remember to share the video with your friends and family. And browse the channel for more quality content. Until next time, walk good, my friends. Teach them!